tournament poker players. Over $1 million in guarantees from April 10th through April 22nd during the Poker Atlas Tour at Texas Cardhouse Houston. 16 different poker tournaments, including the $50,000 guaranteed kickoff event, the $250,000 guaranteed mystery bounty, and the half a million dollar guaranteed main event. For all buy-ins, structures, and information, download the Poker Atlas app and visit texascardhouse.com today. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you guys for tuning in tonight on this wonderful Friday night. We have a 2-5 hold'em running here at Texas Card House RGV. You will have me and Leo Zamaripa in the booth commentating, giving you guys your run on the meal today. Even if we move into here, okay. like Jonathan, Leo, are you there? What's going on? Can you hear me? There you go, buddy. How's oh, there it going? you go. I like making an I like making an entrance, Paul. There you go. There you go. I I prefer to be called Beauty and the Beast. There, Randy. I don't know. Anybody Anybody in the chat? You can let me know who's Beauty and who's the Beast. There you go. Let us know. <laughs> I'm not. I don't want to be Beauty though. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, welcome in today, Leo. We got a nice little lineup today, bro. Um, out in seat one, we're going to have Jimbo come traveling into town, getting on the action. Jimbo, uh, Jimbo, Jimbo. Mm -hmm. Out in seat two, we're going to have our resident baby spider. Shots out to him. Out in seat three, we have Elude. Buying in for 507. Seat four, we're going to have Sobrino. We bought him for 750 in seat five we're going to welcome back jackie moon who bought him for 520. in seat six we have heavy who bought in for 1600 i believe in seat seven we have our resident degenerate poker playing poker dealing gambler john dre the cajun asian out in seat eight we have the snowman and in seat nine we have shadow hopefully we can see him yeah we do have a nice lineup some of these guys have been with us throughout um, this week and last week so i do expect to see action early and often got a ten dollar shadow to open it up i like that already right out of the gates um I believe that is Sobrino with the $10 straddle out there. I expect today to have a little bit more um, openings and three betting. This is my opinion. Right out of the gate. Right on call. We have Jackie Moon opening the King Jack off to 40. Baby spider flats out of the small block with the 10 7 of clubs. You loot also making the call with the ace five of clubs. Okay. Don't want to see any clubs for baby spider, gonna put him in an awkward situation early. Off to a flop of ace four deuce, two spades. Baby spider with the check, elude leading out a hundred with top pair. If Jackie Moon was a little deeper, I'd like a flat here with having the king of spades and backdoor straight draw. But since he's so shallow, I think a fold is the play. Yeah, the bet should take it down. The... Rewarding the first pot of the night to elude. Chat, let us know who you think will be the big winner of tonight's stream. Once again, I want to go ahead and welcome everybody to tonight's stream here at Texas Card House RGV. We will be playing 2-5 every Friday night.
Make your way over and get on on the action. Ten dollar straddles out again. Jackie Moon coming in for someone coming in for a raise. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and say that's uh, Snow with the with the open. I believe it looks like 35. I'm, I'm using my toes and my fingers to make sure I get the right number, and I think it is 35, but Once again, chat, be patient with us as we do have a bit of a lag. We are still in the early stages of our Texas Card House RGV stream, and we ask you guys to please be patient with us. So we got an open from Angel, and we got a three bet on the button from Baby Spider. Baby Spider is going to be my guest to be the highest VPIP of tonight. He loves to splash around. He loves to get involved in a lot of pots, knowing from experience. So I think it's going to be great, a great dynamic for tonight's action. He will be splashing. That's most definitely. I can see Heavy giving in a couple of pots as well. No, with a race to 35, Baby Spider waking up to pocket nines, three betting to 105. Snow with the call, quite don't know what he's holding. Will be interesting as this hand plays out, being that Snow has about $395 left in his stack. Yeah, stack to pot ratio is about three to two. So I see Snow checking, letting Baby Spider take the lead here. If Snow has any overpair or anything like that, he's just going to shove over a Baby Spider yes. bet here. We will see a check raise if he does have an overpair. I agree. Baby Spider's nines looking lovely on the six high board. I like the down bet does give him some fold equity if he feels uh, Angel is does have an overpair angel with the flat so keeping baby spider very 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 entertained here snow with the check again on the turn baby spider wasting no time putting uh snow all in snow making the call if i see two jacks i'll be happy I think he has two jacks. Definitely not in there with air. The flush, the back door flush completing if he did have hearts. Oh, it looks like he might have had pocket eights. Eights, yep. Might be pocket eights. Cooler, oh no, eight five. Turned open-ended, brick on the river. Hey, but he had a pair of fives. It's okay, but he had a pair. <laughs> <laughs> nice hand, Baby Spider. Baby Spider is definitely going to use this to his advantage now, showing an overpair to a board, showing that he's not going to be afraid of three-bet pairs, middle pairs. Uh, you know, Baby Spider is very aware of his image and very aware of, you know, of what he's capable of doing. So by him showing down an actual hand here, will help him later on in the stream for sure. I do agree. And that hair also will definitely help him out later out in the stream as well. So for you at home, just in case y'all are not familiar, the one the white chips are a dollar, the red chips are five dollars, green chips are twenty-five, and the black chips are a hundred. So we we have four chips in play as of right now. Hopefully, if the game gets big enough, we'll have some 500 chips later making making the debut on the Texas Card House stream. But bring until then, the, bringing in the bubble gums would be nice, right? Yeah, I think that'd be a good addition to the stream for sure. We got Shadow opening the, the Ace Nine of Hearts in the low jack to 15. Picking up the button and elude with the King Jack. And Jackie Moon defending his 
big blind. Off to a flop we go, three-handed. Elude smashing the flop with the King Jack. Let's see Jackie Mundo right out of the big blind, who also flopped this, a king leading out. Wants to find out where he's at. He wants to get tropical, that's for sure. That's a line from the movie he's... Yes. Where he's got his... Uh, his name from the tropical. What are they called? I think they're called the the tropicals. I know it's called the tropicals, and uh, I don't know what city they're from. Maybe the Salt Lake Tropicals or something like that. For sure. Six of diamonds on the turn. Action went check check. It is a three-handed pot. Shadow did flop a nine. He was the pre-flop aggressor, and elude on the button with top pair also making the call. Check check to elude. Checks around. Lou taking down another pot, second pot of the night. If Lou keeps winning, he might be able to finish the sleeve with all the money he's going to win. <laughs> it is a good lineup. Um, experienced players across the board. And definitely have some players in there today who are not afraid to get splashy. That's that. That's what's really exciting me today. How about yourself, Leo? Yeah, I definitely agree. Like I said, there's a good mix of splashy with a little bit of tight. So I feel the splashy kind of more uh, aggressive players are going to apply that pressure to the tighter players. And I can't wait to see that dynamic play out throughout the night. Right now, the players are still feeling themselves out, trying to get you know used to everybody, get used to the cameras, get used to the to the limelight. So, once uh, everyone settles in, I, I expect some some fireworks and expect some fun at this table, definitely. Take overs and unders on ten hands before we get our first restraddle. I will definitely take the under. I think Baby Spider wants to see some big pots. I agree. Off to the action we go. We have Baby Spider waking up to pocket sevens in the hijack. Opening it to 30. Picking up a couple of callers and eludes Sobrino and Jimbo. Or JMK. Jack seven deuce one time for the for the stream. Jack How about seven deuce would it be enticing? How about just flopping quads? Que padre vida. <laughs> wow, QPV there, Sobrino. I think. And he's late last to act. Please yeah, just damn. call. Please <laughs> just call. Don't do anything crazy. He is just going to call. Absolutely no reason to do anything else but be calling. Before the end of the hand, he might have all his jewelry in there too, trying to get paid some extra value with that as well. <laughs> Heads up, going to a turn. Seven's dirty. Eight of hearts. Relatively safe card for sevens, but you got to figure what's running through Baby Spider's mind, the fact that Sobrino did call on the flop. So I like big sizing here from Sobrino. If Baby Spider checks, we got to go big, make it look I, like we miss diamonds, make it look like you know we're whiffed a little bit. What are you thinking? Maybe three-fourths pot or full pot? Yeah, I like 200 is good. Yeah, 200 is a good bet. It's a good bet. I mean, I would go over pot also. I don't see Baby Spider folding. It was 200 into a 247, so it's shy of full pot. And he calls. Baby Spider does make the call with the sevens. He's going to see the bad news. And we do have high hands here at Texas Card House, guys. I do want to go ahead and let everybody know we have progressive high hands with rollovers from 9 a.m. to 2 a.m. Monday through Sunday. $100 every hour with rollovers. Aces full of tens to qualify. First payout will be at 5 p.m. and qualifying starts at 9 in the morning. So it does make, make sense to come out here and play these games. Get in there, get a high hand early, and get paid at 5. <laughs> Damn, talk about a segue, Randy. That was perfect, buddy. Look at you <laughs> acting all professional. I like that. After the quads plugging in the high hand, you're, you, you might get a raise after that one, bud. 
That's some I, good segue, and I like it. That's, I most definitely could use a raise. <laughs> that, that was that was a very good segue. If we had drums, I would give you the that for sure. Yep. That was good. I like it, buddy. I like it a lot. Last night we got a um, the rollover the rollover high hands got up to nineteen hundred before it finally hit at two a.m. Um, one of our regulars ended up hitting that late in the night. Shout out to him, Rob, the mailman who played, I believe, on Wednesday's stream, did hit that high hand. So. Got a little extra change to do something strange on the weekend. There you go, buddy. Here, let's get back to this action though. Baby Spider again, coming in with the Ace Eight to the thirty with the thirty-five dollar raise. Elude makes the call. We're gonna see a flop here. Might be the RGV special that we're looking for. Multi-way. That's what we're known for. You got Elude, who's in the hijack, making the call for 35 with pocket sixes. Heavy coming in with the 6-5 off as well. You got Shadow completing with the five deuce of hearts. And JMK says, why not? 6-7. So we're off to a race we go. RGV special. We have a Jack-10-5 rainbow. Or not rainbow, but... Got two diamonds on there. Nobody has any backdoor outs, so. Checks around on the flop. Ace of diamonds on the turn. Baby Spider taking the lead there. Action two, Baby Spider. Who was the pre flop aggressor? Putting out a hundred. Should get through. I don't see anybody else. Maybe the seven of diamonds, but very low. A lot of bad cards on the river for him. Highly unlikely. Yeah, he does. He will take this pot down. Once again, Chad, let us know who you think the big winner and the bigger lose, the biggest loser of tonight will be. Spider loves it. Comes in with another raise now to 30. So, Brina with the Jackie Robinson, the four deuce, making the call. GV special, Jack eight six, a little something for everybody, except Sobrino. <laughs> Checks around, off to the turn we go. Three of spades shouldn't do anything to no one, but it does do something for Sobrino, picking up a gut shot. Well, and Baby Spider, that's that's more than enough for him to, to put some chips in the middle with a nut flush draw and an overcard. That's going to tickle his picket a little bit and see what he does. Jandre leading out 75 with top pair. <laughs> Excuse me. If I know Baby Spider like I think I do, I'm going to see a nice, healthy raise here so he can take advantage. He can take the lead on the bet on the betting. Well, I'm going to keep my foot in my mouth and just because he just calls. JMK with the call. Baby Spider with the call. 
Baby oh. Spider taking the lead on the river. Must be nice. Just eh, ace. No big deal. I got the lead. Diamonds did complete, though. Looks like JMK is going to go ahead and take advantage of those diamonds and put out a bet. Having that Queen of Diamonds is a very good card for him. I like Baby Spider I, releasing the ace. Definitely. I really like that he has that Queen of Diamonds in his hands. You know, makes hands like King, Queen of Diamonds, Queen, Ten of Diamonds, very, very likely holdings of his. I, I think if he doesn't have that Queen of Diamonds, his play doesn't make sense. But since he holds that, it gives him a very good opportunity to make this uh, bluff. Yeah, I like it as well. Jondre in the tank, thinking about it, trying to piece it together. Let's see if he sniffs it out. Well, he is the raging Cajun. So the, the Cajun Asian. Oh, the raging Cajun. <laughs> oh, there, something like that. Yeah, he's only raging when he's on tilt. Oh, I knew it. I think I think GMK shows it if 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 Jondre folds here. And he'll Let use it to chat. advantage. Do you think Jondre calls one for yes, two for no? Let us know, chat. Let's get active. And three, if you want to order us a pizza. <laughs> Once again, guys, I do want to apologize to you, everyone watching at home. We are on a bit of a lag. We ask that you stay patient with us. I think it's because they haven't had this much heat on the mics in a while. You and me together is really ca causing a lot of electrical magic to happen. So might be causing that lag, guys. We apologize. Andre ultimately making the fold could not show sniff it out. It, show it, show it. God, I would like for him to show it. That would be great for the game. I think he probably elected not to show it, being the fact that he hasn't been in the room quite too often. He used to, he does play quite a bit. He does, he is familiar with some of the players, but I think he wants to keep um, he's his OG. game under wraps for now. For sure, I remember playing with him back in the day too. At, at uh, back when I first started coming up to the Upper Valley, hadn't seen him in a while. It's good to see him back on the streets, you know. I thought he was good for the game then, and hopefully he uh, he makes it <coughs> makes it a more weekly thing, you know, coming out, getting back on the streets. We are playing with a button straddle on this hand. Action will be on snow in the small blind. Got a fold there. Action's now on, I believe, Shadow, who's in seat nine. Shadow's still hiding the shadows. Hasn't played a hand yet. Look at him, I'm here all week. I'm not sure if you picked up on this, Leo, or not, but did you see when uh, Action is around to Shadow, he does have his face on the seat number yeah i did sure. see that i'm not quite sure how he did it but I'm i mean impressed. no that's pretty good that's pretty strong shows a a lot of attention uh, attention to detail and i really like that going forward i i think uh everyone should have a picture on there it's through the app uh if, if you get on the app there's a RF, scan right yeah you can place a picture on there so he's not operating in the shadows N no he's definitely not He's definitely not operating the shadows. He's he's in the light. Off to a monotone board we go of nine eight four all hearts. Baby Spider holding that nut heart leads out for forty five. Jondre with a call. Oh, don't hit the ten, Jondre, because last time you hit a straight, we know what happened then. <laughs> King of Spades on the turn. Option is on Baby Spider goes ahead and bets pot now really putting Jondre in the pressure cooker easy fold Oh, 
Shout out to those in the chat. We have Ashley, Stephanie, David, Belio, Edson. Shout outs, Fernando, Rini. We got a couple of chat ninjas. Hi, yeah. Speaking about ninjas, who remembers Three Ninjas, the movie? One of my favorites. Old school classic movie. Rocky loves Emily. Emily. I was more of a tum tum kind of guy. Still am more of a tum tum kind of guy. No pun intended. Tum tum, the Twizzlers. The Twizzlers. That's such a good show. JMK completing the $10 straddle. Baby Spider having none of it. Making it 50 to go, 60 to go with the Queen 10 of Hearts. Shadow making the call with the Queen Jack off. Heavy making the call with the 6 5 off. Three handed to a flop we go. I would like to call out Heavy's color coordination with the Boston Red Sox navy blue and red with the navy blue and red shirt. I believe that looks very sharp. His, his stylist did a great job today getting him ready for the, for the stream. It does, but I'm on the pinstripe side, buddy. So, I mean, we can't all be... We all can't be perfect, Randy. I, I mean, I, I'm a big Atlanta Braves fan. Baby Spider leading out 75. Shadow with a gut shot making the call. They share out, so it's going to be interesting. Nobody wants to make a pair right now. It's a great card for Baby Spider picking up the flush draw, who is the pre-flop aggressor and did have the act the aggression on the flop as well. I don't see him slowing down, to be honest with you. Not at all. I I, I like for him to bet big here to deny equity from any any kings, any ace littles, stuff like that. So I, I would definitely like to see a big. There it is, and he makes right. a big bet of uh, 285. Right on the target. Yeah, I he it's a good sizing, especially. For hands like that, Queen Jack can't continue facing that much heat, you know? Did, did he show? No, he did not show. No, Baby Spider doesn't show. He we want to see. It. Once there's a once it gets down there, I wouldn't be surprised if they do get into a seven-dudes game or some kind of game to really spice up that action. I agree. I agree. I think it will be something that really – if people get stuck enough, people want will do anything to get unstuck, so – Shout out to Isai in the chat who said he's making his way over to the card house as we speak. Shout out to Kyle. And shout out to Salvador back at home watching the game. The real MVPs. Actions on Elude under the gun. No straddle up to this point. 10-4 is going to find its way into the muck. So Brino wanting to redeem himself from the last time he was on stream. The ace-five offsuit making a call. I really prefer coming in with a raise with the ace-five offsuit especially. Doesn't flop very well out of position. So just for your viewers back home, you know, just a little strategy. You want to be coming in with the ace-five. You want to be coming in with a raise more than a limp. Jackie Moon, under the gun plus two, making it 25 to go with pocket sixes, which inclined picked up heavy with the 7-8 offsuit, and also bringing in Shadow with the A7 of clubs. So Brino completing. We're going to see a flop four-handed. Going to a flop four-handed, Cotton. We call that the RGV special, buddy. <laughs> you get a seven. You get a seven couple of sevens in there. Sobrino flopping bottom pair. With the backdoor spade, I, I see him sticking around at least for one bet. Check, check. Around a heavy with the 7-8. Leading out for 50. Second pair. 
potential back doors. Ooh, I like calling once there. Especially with, with the, the ace of spades. spades. Yeah. With bottom pair. No. I agree. Your, your hand's very disguised in that situation. Heads up. To a flop we go. Shadow holding the dominating seven with the ace kicker, right? That's Two a pairs. great card. Yeah, it's a great card for, for sevens. I don't. Heavy leading out for 75. I don't see Shadow making a fold. If he caught on the flop and the 10 on the turn really didn't change anything for him. Should be making the call, I want to say, about 20, 35% of the time. What do you think? Yeah, no, I, like, I like the bet by Heavy. He also blocks 8-9, having an 8 in his hand. So, I mean, it's a good bet by him. I would like to bet smaller as, you know, kind of throw out a, a, a blocker bet because he's only going to get called by hands that beat him. Does that make sense? So, that if you bet small, yeah, if, if, if he bets a little smaller there, you know, it, it's going to get the same information as, as that $75 bet. So, if he bets 35 or 30 he Shadow can't raise. He can only call in that spot. So, by him leading to 30 or 35 it's going to be the same as the $75 bet. You know what I mean? I do agree. Yeah, so, I mean, that's just, you know, just a little tidbit for later on, you know, when we throw out blocker bets like that and we, we're putting our hands. He had to be putting his hand on his opponent on a hand similar to a seven, six, seven, something like that. Something where it's, it's a middling pair where he's trying to push his opponent off. And uh, he could have got the same information by, by uh, block betting a lot smaller. Yeah, and there wouldn't be too many worse sevens. Maybe the six seven, uh, five seven, which would have flopped two pair and been counterfeited on the turn. But uh, yeah, no, exactly. That that that's that's why we have to look at it in that perspective. Baby Spider with two threes. Now let's get back to this action and more than enough for him to make a race for sure. No, he does make the call. He is in the small blind, so he does have heavy action behind him. Oh, heavy raise pre-flop. I missed that. Heavy, coming in heavy. I wonder if he rides a Chevy. So you have a JMK who had a $10 button straddle. Baby Spider making the call. Elude making the call. And Heavy coming in with a $45 raise. I would have liked it to for him to size up there. Especially, I mean, he's holding King 8 of hearts. I think. Yeah, with two limps in front of him, you definitely got to play that into play that into effect for yes. sure. Uh, with the ten dollars straddle, so it's already a lot of dead money out there. Definitely like a bigger sizing. Just gonna check around to Sobrino with the queen ten second pair, ten kicker making a a bet of forty five. A little ostentatious of him, kind of a reach, um, especially with so many pre-flop aggressors out there. Not something we I like doing. Um, you open yourself up to a check raise instead of keeping what equity, little equity you do have in your hand. You know what I mean? So I, I prefer a check call than a than a lead because now you just bloated a pot with middle pair. And you, yes, I believe so. And you have JMK on the button who looks like he smashed this flop. He has top pair, nut flush straw. I can see him. He's going to about a three bet this pot. He actually comes in with the call. Um, Decide on a call. Which is very interesting to say the least. It allows Heavy to play catch up here and now uh, has a gut shot with Nut Hearts. So it's going to continue. It's going to let Heavy continue in this hand when with a raise, it would have definitely eliminated Heavy. Yeah, you have Sobrino holding a pair and a gutty. Heavy holding a gutty and a flush straw. The Nut Flush Straw, that be. Pot has ballooned to $610 quickly. It's going to be an interesting river. Let's see what this brings. If anything red comes, we're going to have some more blood on our hands. 
Damn, Kay, you're looking to make the call. Jack of spades, no help to no one. Boring river card. Well, there is 600, 600 babies out there, and who wants them? Heavy, heavy with the check, gave up on this hand. This is the JMK, he goes check, check. I mean, in hindsight, we can see the cards super easy for us to say heavy needs to bet there. But as passive as JMK played that hand, I prefer a larger size betting there in that spot as opposed to him leading out with the 8-7. So it's crazy how poker, certain instances call for a small bet, certain instances call for a big bet. You know what I mean? And I think that in that certain spot, I think a big bet might have taken it down, especially how passive JMK played his top pair in flush draw. Right? Yes, sir. I do agree. Anyone seen John Dre? I mean, the guy's usually splashing. He's uh, maybe hiding a little bit. Again, guys, we will do our, our best to bring you guys a balanced strategy, and we will mute ourselves at times to let you guys get into the table talk as well. Was there a strata on this hand, Randy? I want to say there was a $10 straddle. And if there wasn't, I do believe that Heavy did. I did see Heavy put some chips in, so there wasn't. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I'm going to go ahead and take the time, guys, to let you guys know that we here at Texas Card House RGV, we do have an early bird bonus where you do get two for one in time up to $100 every day at 10 a.m must be purchased at the host desk guys make your way over and play here at texas card house rgv where it does pay to play got a button straddle here for me lude you know actually going to be on the small blind button straddle also called the mississippi straddle we called that everywhere except mississippi Jackie Moon making the call with the King Four of Hearts. Feeling a little frisky. That's a little interesting call there. I like it. John Dre, it's as if he was listening to the chat on command one hand later, making a raise with the Ace Jack off to 45. Bringing in Shadow with the Ace Jack off. <laughs> I'm going to make a prediction here. I feel JMK and Baby Spider will play an all-in or a massive pot by the end of the night. Mark my words. We have JMK making the call with the King-10 offsuit as well. That one more person, I believe, that went ahead and made the call. We're going to a flop four ways. Jackie Moon making the call as well. To a seven deuce deuce. Squad deuce for everybody. Survey says boring. Jackie Moon with a check. John Dre with a bit of a down bet to 35. As a preflop aggressor, I definitely do like this play. Uh, it's going to deny equity from a lot of ace highs, a lot of king highs, a lot of backdoor stuff. So as a preflop aggressor, I do like it. I see Shadow coming along with such a small bet uh, with the ace of clubs, and his, all his backdoor equities are there. Good. 
it's interesting to see how the turn plays out. It's going to dictate a lot of what happens on the river. Jondre with a quick check. Shadow with a quick check behind. Six of hearts. I think it goes check, check. You know what they say, right, Randy? I don't have a sister, so I'm not too sure. What What do they say? Chopping the pot's definitely like kissing your sister. <laughs> wow. I, I, I would like Shadow to, after Jundry checks that turn and, and checks the river, I would like for him to fire out. He has... A, Jondre is in essence waving the white flag there, especially yeah, he, after that board. Yeah, especially after that board. He could have got away with a, maybe an eighty-five, even a hundred-dollar bet, and could have took down that pot. Um, Definitely, yeah. I, I would like from. I would like to see that. You know, it takes a lot of courage from a lot of poker players, and those of y'all that are watching, they're just learning or trying. It's, it's okay to bluff and get called. Like it's not a bad thing. Like you don't look dumb. You don't. Like it's okay to bluff and get called. It's better to do that than only bet when you have a hand, right? You don't want to play perfect always. So just a little bit of information for you there. There is a $10 shadow from John Dre. We do have 10 out front by John Dre. Shout out to those in the chat once again. Blanca, Beatrice, just jumped on. We see you. We hear you. We got Sal asking us where we're located. We are located here in the beautiful, beautiful city of Edinburgh, Texas, here in the RGV, the all-American city. Wow. I feel alive when you said that. It really inspired me, Randy. The all-American city. I like that, buddy. Little cut off of All American. I've been watching it a lot lately. Very nice, very nice. Off to a flop we go of Jack 10 8, Rainbow. Elude holding the King Queen for an open ender. Does make a bet and does take it down. I'm going to go ahead and take the time, guys, to go ahead and show you guys. That is our progressive high hands with rollovers from 5 p.m. to 2 a.m. Make your way over. I see people coming out into the main floor as we speak. $100 high hands every hour. Aces full of tens to qualify. Make your way over. They let you out on the main floor? Wow, Randy. I got to ask for better work conditions. I'm over here stuck in a closet, buddy. Must be nice. Action off to, onto Snow, who makes a call with the 5-4 of hearts. Shadow completing with the Jack-10 offsuit. JMK also completing with the 9-7 off. Sobrino, Queen-9 nine, queen nine of spades, selecting to make the call as well out of the cutoff. And I believe Jackie Moon making the call with the Jack-10. Oh, with the Ace-5 off, I'm sorry. Off to a flop we go of ace, six, four, two clubs. Nobody holding a club. Snow leading for 25 with a bottom pair, potential backdoor straights. Jackie Moon on the button making the call. A pair of aces. You know what else they say, right, Randy? Don't drink... Don't drink yellow, yellow snow. Don't drink yellow snow. <laughs> to a turn we go, the three of clubs. Bringing potential backdoor straights, but it is a scary card being that it is a club. Snow checks. Jackie Moon. I want to say leads out for 55 and Snow making the call with the third pair open ender. Eight of spades on the river. No help to Snow. Actually, I'm 
Action goes check, check, and Jackie Moon will see the good news. Snow was in a whole world of hurt there. Um, that three made him lose an extra bet there. Kept him along. Definitely not a great card for him. At best, he was going to chop. And uh, he was really, really handcuffed in that hand. Uh, by check calling and not really taking full advantage of it. Like, you got to... He didn't take the lead betting. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let me just shut my mouth and let's get our first double straddle in. We got that straddle and that restraddle. And 15. The Five over. hands after. It went over. <laughs> Luckily, nobody took that bet. <laughs> so we have... Um, Shadow with the ten dollar straddle and JMK with the restraddle to twenty. Elude with Park the Snowman making the call. Action on Sobrino with the Queen Deuce off. He's gonna find his way into the mug. And they were in the backyard. They were like, "Whoa!" And he's like, "I promise you, I'm not gonna hit you. Nowhere close to you." Have you ever aimed your Heavy loves it. Heavy loves it. He's going to come along here. No, like it goes straight to your aim. Heavy with the 9 7 off on the button. Super out of bounds. Has the power. Lex to make the call. What do, you know? what do you know? The man who has the double straddle waking up to pocket jacks, or as I would say, as Brad Owen says, the pocket jiggities. Dig it, dig it. I mean, it's just. Life's so good when you wake up with Jackson and you're the double straddle. Like QPV, you know what I mean? Got you. Off to a flop we go, three handed. 6-3 deuce. Action on JMK. I like a down bet here to keep some of these over cards in. You know, try to get as much as much as he can from, from hands like the two eights and, and two over cards. I like, the med 90. I like it. I like it a lot. A little under half pot. I don't see a loot going on anywhere with pocket eights. Not at all. Over pair to the board. All. Definitely. Heads up to a turn, we're gonna go. Yikes. Haven't seen anything uglier than since the last time I looked myself in the mirror. That's an ugly turn card. Shout out to Val in the chat, just joining. Ace of Diamonds on the turn should slow down JMK. But stranger things have happened. Neither player's holding a diamond. He does elect to check. Elude. I would potentially stab here. Maybe try to rep the ace. He does bet 200. Without a heart in his hand, it's going to be a, a hard call for JMK, especially there's a lot of ugly rivers we don't want to see. You know, any king, any queen, any diamond, you know, anything like that. That's, uh, that's those are some, some bad turn cards. So if it's a $200 bet now, we can only imagine what the river sizing is going to be. You know what I mean? If he's turning his eights into a bluff right now. Well, you got to figure if you're calling 200, you might as well figure you might call off the other 274. Is that all he has left? Yeah, oh, that's, that's all, all he, he has, has left. left. And the Jack of Diamonds that. will does not help you. So yeah, exactly. No, no, in you're actuality, right. he's looking at one out left. So I don't think he makes the call here. I do like the bet by Elude. He's finding out right now if, if those eights are going to withstand the heat. And I don't think he believes they are. I really think now he's turning his hand into a bluff. He has no diamonds. He knows that he a diamond's a bad card for him. I believe this. he's turning his eights into a bluff, and he, he's putting JMK exactly on what he has. 
1,000%. Yeah, I, I really believe that's the case right now, and he's really hoping for a fold here. JMK, deep in the tank, wondering, well, what did you call me with on the flop if it was not already a made hand? But he elects to make the fold and will wait for another time, a better spot. Show it, show it. I do apologize for the picture, guys. If you are getting a bit of a ghosty picture, we are working on our... Well, I just brain farted. It's all right. Hey, it happens to the best of us. Better from the brain, the brain than from the behind. <laughs> JMK with the Queen Nine offsuit. The gun does make the call. Six five for Baby Spider suited, right in his wheelhouse. Yeah, I don't think we will see Baby Spider making many many flat calls pre-flop. If he's going to play, I do believe he will be coming in for raises most of the time. As it should be. Um, poker's a funny thing, man. When, when you get a lot of people limping and uh, a lot of stuff like that, it makes for a better game. But when you're raising, you really take control of it. And you have the ability to check to three bet. <laughs> You know, you give yourself an, op an an opportunity to win the pot when you raise. I you know that you are the author of your own story. Thank you, R.L. Stein. I like that. And we are off to a flop, as my co-host likes to say, with the RGB special. Seventeen people in. A little bit of something for somebody out there. Off to an Ace Ten Eight board. Two hearts. We have Jackie Shadow Moon. and Jackie Moon holding hearts. Flopping the world, Jackie Moon, flopping the world. I'm a little upset Johnny didn't go for a designer today. He had Louis Vuitton, he had Gucci, Balenciaga, and I think now he has uh, Academy. He might have a Dior shirt underneath that uh, Aria. I think I believe it's an Aria jacket. Oh, okay, okay. Either that or I was going to say his boxers have to be silk. <laughs> Jackie Moon overbets the pot with a pair, with bottom pair and a flush draw. Shadow thinking about putting on his dancing shoes. Not sure if the six high of hearts is good. He is in the tank. So what's your opinion of getting in there in a speculative pot with a hand like that? That's just, this is some of the problems that you might run into post-flop, right? Yeah, definitely. Um, when you call with the six deuce of hearts, what are you trying to accomplish here? Like, if you flop hearts, are you going to fold? No, because that's why you called pre-flop. Like, so you have to ask yourself that question. Is it worth calling pre-flop? If I flop hearts, now I'm facing a bet, am I going to fold? So when you call with hands that are subpar, are you going to get it in when you actually flop something with equity? You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I had the privilege of playing with Shadow a little bit last night, and uh, I want to say he's going to make the call. He did, he did lead for 50. Jackie Moon shoved all in for 445. It's 395 more to call. Shadow sitting on about 445 and change or something right around that neighborhood. Yeah, a little less, a, a little less than uh, two to one to make the call here. He has to think his hearts are good. Um, unfortunately, Jackie Moon has the exact hand. He does not want to see if he makes this call. You know what I mean? You want to see the ace king of spades. You want to see the, the jack nine. You want to see hands like that. You don't want to see a pair in a flush draw because he's in a world of hurt. Like, he's this is the worst possible scenario for Shadow. Yeah, besides, a, besides a flashlight, of course. Mm -hmm. Well, we'll let him, we'll let him think. He's in the pressure cooker. Uh, 
I'm not gonna lie, I'm really digging this the picture on the side. Shout out to those jumping in in the chat. We have Mikey, Juan Boo Boo Lopez, Ruby, Alfonso. Thank you guys. Oh, for baby, us we got a whoa, Friday we got a night. call. Oh. Randy, we got a call, buddy. He's gonna see the world of hurt he's in. He can run it two, three, four times. It's gonna be hard for him to win this pot. He is looking for all running outs. Oh, no. Six six deuce deuce, and that should be a wrap. Jackie Moon with a full house. Got the jack on the turn. No help to no one. It should put the lock on this hand. He could have got the Rasaka and the Ocean, and he still would have been in a world of hurt. Chat, just so you know, it's a little quick review of that hand. We were talking about it before. When you make a speculative call with the six use of hearts and you flop a, a flush draw, a six high flush draw, you are flopping what you're calling pre flop for. So he did not expect for Jackie Moon to have the Jackie of Hearts like he did. He had he thought his flush draw was, was live, and that's why he made that call. There's nothing else you can do but make that call. I would have made the call if I jump in there with a six deuce. I mean, it's either you're looking for hearts or you're looking for a six dix deuce board, right? Yeah, exactly. I mean, I, I would have called definitely with your money, Randy. I don't know about mine, but your money, I'm definitely, it's definitely out there. If we run like Randy, we would have ran six six and then deuce deuce, you know? Oh, yeah, that turn in river would have came deuce deuce, most definitely. <laughs> Shadow's all in for 48. The nine eight of diamonds. I like it. Baby spider showing no relentlessness, getting putting his foot on the throat with the king seven. Oh, shadow out flopping him. Oh, that should do it. Today is Friday night here at Texas Card House, guys. It is Friday night, and I do want to let all the ladies know we do have buy two hours, get two hours free Thursday nights from 5 p.m. to midnight. Oh, this is Dallas. I'm sorry. Where's ours at? Excuse me. Mm -hmm. I got the world's smallest uh, screens. <laughs> We got a ten dollar straddle from Elude. <laughs> Sabrino limping. Jackie Moon with the King Eight of Spades. I think this qualifies under his hand ranges for a raise, and he comes along with a fifty-five dollar raise. Jackie Moon steadily picking up chips. I do have a lot of history with Jackie Moon, and Jackie Moon does like to get splashy, especially when he's picking up those babies. Can we elaborate on this history? Can we get a hand history? Can we get anything? There's too many hands to think of. I played with him a little yesterday as well. We are heads up. So Reno and Jackie Moon taking a flop here. To a 10 7 3 2 hearts board, no help to no one. If you bet it, you take it. 
Tobino does have backdoor straight, backdoor hearts. I would like to see him peel. He did release a backdoor opportunity earlier. Uh, he is getting 3-1 to one on a call here. I'd, I'd like to see a call for sure. I think he's out there, boys. We're going to see a turn. Looking for a heart, looking for a 5-ish. It's red, but it's a diamond, not what he's looking for. Jackie Moon turning the king. Interesting card. Some quick bet, quick check, quick bet, quick fold. We are with you guys. 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. tonight, guys. Let's let's get this game going. What do you say, Leo? We can get, let's pick a number from 100 to 140. Can we get over 140 views tonight? Maybe Let's, keep the stream going a little longer than normal. I like 150 active viewers at one time, and I say the stream stays on. Let's do it. Come on, chat ninjas. We have 82 on all platforms, plus 37 right now on uh, Facebook. So we're, we're, we're close We're close to it. So let's see if we can get 150 active viewers and let's see if we can throw 30 minutes on an extra 30 minutes on there. JMK with a button straddle. Baby Spider waking up to King Kong in the small blind. Ho, baby. With the $10 straddle. It likes to just flat. Sneaky, sneaky. That flat is going to bring in quite a bit of players. So... Brings in Elude, brings in Sobrino. Go heavy ahead loves it. Heavy. Jandre getting in there. Snow folding. Shadow ripping it. It's music to Spider's ears at this point. Yeah, so much dead money out there. JMK is going to make the call. Spider. Waiting to attack and release his spiderous venom on all these dead money out there. Definitely going to punish the limpers. 240-ish. Oh. Does race the 240 on the money. Look at these people dropping like flies. Sobrino taking his time here. Don't do it, buddy. Save yourself. Not quite sure what he's holding. What does he have? Queen Jack, Queen of, Jack of Clubs. Club. He looks pretty, but doesn't flop well in this situation. John Dre, all in. Little backdoor action. No, well, he can come in the front door. If he hits hard. Yeah, 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 for sure. But he backdoored the back oh, door. Back squeeze. He came with the back, back, back little, door little, squeeze. The back little, squeeze. Little, little back squeeze. Little, little back shove. Mm. How much is he holding? 255. 255. Oh. So it's not much, yeah. Action back on it. JMK seeing a bloated pot of 675 before the cards are even out. Holding an A7, a suited A7 at B. I think I, he's I think he he's blinded by all the dead money out there, but his hand is very easily dominated in a lot of spots. Yeah, I don't see him making the call, but like I said earlier, stranger things have happened. Oh, yeah. Look at Netflix. Dig it in. <laughs> the chat's calling, saying that they feel spades coming on the flop. What do you think? Let us know what you guys think the flop is coming and looking like. And he does complete and makes the call. Oh, no. He back shoves. All in for 1,251. Action back on Baby Spider. Holding the pocket kings. I called it. And has them. Covered. He I does called call. it. I called Quick it. Call. 
whole you baby. Call it the biggest pot in Texas card house, Rio Grande Valley history. Two hundred or two hundred, excuse me, two thousand eight hundred and sixty-two dollars. Let's see three cards, dealer, please. We are multi-way and are going to see yeah. all five. Yeah. Wow, this is fun. Two people looking for an ace. Jandre looking for hearts. I did tell you at the beginning of this stream, we did have an active, fun-filled table today. Here we go. I want you all to know I, I did do opera in my first life. Come on, baby. Get us three cards. I'd like to see a flush draw for somebody. Let's get a little sweat. I want to see everybody flop something. That'd be great. That'd stay be... alive. Everybody stay alive. An eight, jack, seven board. Giving everybody a pair. Baby Spider wins this pot. He will have enough to get more hair gel for his hair that he takes care of so well. Oh, the anticipation's killing me. As myself. I don't know if I'm hungry or if it's indigestion or I'm nervous. I can see the floor out where I'm at, and the floor, it's, 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 and the, the whole floor is anticipated on this hand. I got about 10 people standing, not caring about their hand at all, in the moment, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, we got percentages. There's an eight. eight three. No. Andre with a pair of eights. Uh-oh. There's the seven. Wow! Ace on the river. JMK. Out of nowhere is going to get half this pot. Wow. Well, he's going to get more than half. I believe uh, Shadow only had $79. Well, I don't, and I, some people are running it once. Some people are running it twice. So Andre would have got in there twice. He would have. He does get some money back. He does have hearts. I believe the big pot of JMK and Baby Spider, they're chopping the side. I'm so confused and I'm so excited. I'm so nervous. I want to cry, laugh, and cuddle with Ruby at the same time. I don't know what to do. There's so many chips going everywhere, and I don't know who won what. Give us a minute to see if we can dissect this, chat. That is the biggest pot in our Texas Card House RGV streaming history. And we're just getting started, guys. We are just getting started. We are here every Friday night, 6 p.m. to 10 p.m., welcoming any and all newcomers to come out to Texas Card House RGV. Check out our room. Ask for managers. Ask for myself, Randy Chavez. Randy runs it up on all social media platforms, along with our co-host, Leo Zamaripa. On all social media platforms, I believe as well, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh man, I was hiding under my little table on that last one. What a hand! JMK says, "I haven't been here. I'm gonna leave my mark on this stream." Boom! Take your kings and my A7. I'm just gonna chop you up. Wow! 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 I do want to go and let the chat know and let you know, Leo. I do see some cash cash killers out here. I hadn't seen in a minute. They are walking through the door. I'm sure they are adding their names to this list. If any potential seats open up, I do see some of these guys for sure are going to be more than willing to take those seats. Well, if that's the case, then I think we should just get a second table going and make it a must move. If it's going to get this good weekly either that or we need to have another stream this good this early it's only been an hour in and i'm i'm already having panic attacks over here back to the action 
I'm not sure who made it 20, but he did pick up quite a bit of callers. Back as a, my co-host, Leo, likes to say, the RGB special off to a flop we go of Jack-10 deuce, two hearts. And Lou checks. Sobrino with the king three off. Boss leading for 65 with the I king hope we high. Had... That's, that's pretty G. I'll give him that. It is gangster. You have John Dirt with the nut flush draw making the call. Snow floating down those snowmen. Heads up to a turn. We're going to go. Oh, baby. I'm assuming there could be a misreading. So Reno could be holding the king three of hearts. I'm not 100%, but just speculative at this point. Seven of spades on the turn. That would be kind of dirty if that's the case. Yeah, plus he continues plus. to lead. Yeah, he continues to lead. I don't see the three of diamonds as a possible suitor for his second card. Maybe king, queen, maybe something else, but I don't see it. John Dre's still just making the call, letting the letting the hook set in. If a heart comes, no. Five of spades on the river. No help to no one. John Dre with the ace high out front. Action on Sobrino holding king high. Knows he can only win the pot by betting. And he does bet 100. I don't know if I like this this sizing. It's a bit on the smaller side. I would have went up a little bit more. I, I might have gone to 240, to be honest with you. Maybe even 190. A, a tad bit. I'm not 100%. Yeah. This is giving... It's getting 5-1 to one on a call. I like a call here for whatever reason. Jandre does make the fold. Not sure we know what we're talking about, though, but <laughs> Sobrino yeah. takes down the pot. I 100% make the call with ace high on a 5-1. to one. You will almost always get me to call. Yeah, they, they let anybody they let anybody commentate these days. But, <laughs> like I said, we're just here to break down as best as we can. I think I see a $35 I saw a $35 straddle. My eyes were deceiving me there. I got a little excited. At 35, we would be blood in the water. I'm going to go in on a limb and say that Sobrino was holding the king three of hearts. I, I will ask him as soon as I get a chance to ask him. Maybe the king jack. It's possible that the king jack was there too. King and jack, king queen. He was value betting a jack. It's very, very, very possible. You know what technology, technology these days. And if he was just boss with the king three offsuit, hats off to you, sir. At that point, I would definitely take my hat off to him. Action on heavy with the king jack off. I'm probably getting laughed at by our one of our regulars, Gabe, back at home. Shout out to my mother-in-law, Ms. Gracie Mendoza, watching the stream. Had to score some points there. Brownie points. And definitely. She does make great brownies, by the way. Heavy making it 40 to go. Action on John Dre with the King 7 off. Probably gonna wait find his way. We have a... Snow with the call? No? We have Cool Raoul making his way into the room. Saw that, saw that. Uh, Shout, out. Crusher. Shout out. Shout out, Ruru. Sobrino coming in with a call with the jack eight off. Says king three was good enough. King three off. I can definitely make the jack eight off work. No gamble, no future. Off to a flop we go. Heads up. Something for everybody. Ace Jack three rainbow board. Heavy with the bet. So Brando's not folding to one bet. I don't think. Ah, what do I know? 
does make the fold. Does call the 40, free, flop second pair, makes the fold. Heavy playing the ace. Uh, I'd like um, maybe just go ahead and fold there pre, not defend the big blind. Yeah, if you're going to flop a pair and not call to one bit, heads up, I, I, I prefer to fold. Definitely go fold. Ten dollars strato now, coming in from John Dre. The Cajun Asian on all so, social media platforms. Did we find out what happened on that? Who won the most? I, I'm still, I'm sure people are wondering. JMK did scoop a nice size pot. You got to figure the main pot that had shadow in it for seventy five. Someone and there ran was, it there was, there was three pots. So you had their main pot that had Shadow, Baby Spider, John Dre, and JMK in there. And your second pot, which had JMK, John Dre, and Baby Spider. And the big side pot on the side got chopped. So I'm assuming either John Dre didn't run it twice or Shadow didn't run it twice. So, yeah. so the main pot did get sent to jmk i believe so okay because he i mean his stack is significantly bigger yeah he's holding 1.7 and i believe he started the hand with 1200 or 1100 yes jmk holding the ace king offsuit in the low jack elude in the cutoff with the three four off Actually bet goes check fold. bet fold. No. Not a fold. Check bet call. Swing and a miss for us again. Jeez. We're on fire, Randy. With the bad news bears. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Maybe we should go play so they can take some of our money. Elu just says, announcers who? Let me bet. Let me take. Let me win. With the four high, like a boss. I do like it. He had position. Checking his weakness, he says. He does take down the pot. I want to see if we get another straddle, restraddle. Yeah, the, definitely. The one we had did create the biggest pot of the night so far. And I don't second think biggest. that's the second biggest. And I don't see that being. I think we are going to have some big pots throughout the rest of the night. And we, once again, I do want to go ahead and thank the viewers at home that are tuning in with us here at Texas Card House RGV for tonight. We have Snow with the $10 straddle out front. Action will be on Shadow. <laughs> JMK making the call with the 7-5 of clubs. A couple of folds around. Action back on heavy. The queen jack. Offsuit. Electing to make the raise out of the big blind. Opens it up to 45. Snow with the king six of hearts making the call and JMK coming along with the seven five of clubs. Three ways to a flop. No bottom pair no for one. snow. Yeah, bottom pair for snow. Goody for JMK. Good card. Good turn card for heavy. Should let him continue here. Pot was 140. He does bet 75. Little right at half pot. I do like it. Nice pot to you, sir. I wonder where the name Heavy comes from. Heavy D up in the limousine. It was all a dream, though.
George, I see you in the chat. Make your way down here, buddy. I'll jump on and play when I see you here in the room, bud. It's been some time. Shout out to you, man. Shadow electing to raise the King 10 from under the gun. He is suited. Makes it 15 to go. King, Queen, offshoot. I like a three bit. Shoot it. I like to see it. JMK making the call. So Reno making the call with the ace baby. Jackie Moon with the 6 5 off. Getting in there like swimwear. Jandre getting frisky with the 10 8 as well. You know what they call this, right? No, what do they call it? The RGV special. Because everybody sees a flop here at Texas Card House, Rio Grande Valley. Wow, oh, the crowd went silent there. Mm hmm. Couple of checks. JMK with a thirty dollar bet. So Brino raises to ninety. Days high. Not buying what JMK is selling. JMK making the call. And we're gonna go heads up to a turn. I didn't realize that they're both holding nut diamonds. Oh, so Brino holding the nut diamond and JMK holding the king of diamonds. A diamond will be disaster, but I don't know. <laughs> JMK rivering trips. I like JMK to either lead small or check. What do you think? Yeah, yeah. I like leading small again. It's just so. It's gonna be so hard for Sabrina to have a hand here. She has. Uh, it's just. It's very hard for him to have a hand. He's smashing that board. Diamonds, trips. JMK does lead. I would have liked for him to check or lead very small because Sobrino might just turn that nut flush draw into a into a bluff for sure. A I bluff. like that a lot. But it's easier in here than it is out there. Oh, a hundred percent. I'm. I can take on anybody if if I can see the cards. I'm the best card seer, poker player in the world. Mr. Leo. <laughs> Mrs. Cleo. Snow with the A6 offsuit. <laughs> Raising the 20. <laughs> I have a small blind with the ace high. I believe that's the first raise and take we've had in all the streams, if I'm not mistaken, dude. Yes, could potentially be. I'm going to go ahead and... Guys, I do welcome you guys to make it out for the Poker Atlas Tour out in Texas Card House, Houston. From April 10th through April 22nd, we do have 16 events, over a million dollars in guarantees. 
put it in your calendars and make your way out there this April from the 10th through the 22nd, guys. We have action, baby. We have a straddle, restraddle, restraddle. So you're saying we got a re re? We have all kinds of re re's. Action is on Jackie Moon. Jackie Moon, pocket threes with so much potential dead money out there makes it makes it forty dollars to go. It's gonna hear the bad news right away. Heavy with the ace king of spades right behind him, re-raising to 150. Heavy is active this game. So he will find some callers. So it was a straddle to a straddle to ten, resettle to twenty, restraddle to forty. Jackie Moon limbs for forty. Heavy makes it one fifty. So Rino now with the ace queen of diamonds actually has a hand here. Let's see how he goes ahead and plays this. He's in there, boys. Does make the call. And Jackie Moon, pocket threes makes ahead right calls. now. Everyone get the gloves ready. It may get bloody. There is potential. Off to a flop of 5-5-8. Five, five, Two hearts. Relatively safe flop. I'd say the pocket threes could get in there and see a turn. But you do have Sobrino making the I, lead i really like this play here his flats have all pairs in them his flats have all the heart combinations especially since heavy's not holding any i really like this play here i like his sizing it's kind of saying i'm come on call me with your overcards i'm ready to play for mm -hmm. all the all the pot for all the babies right the, the thing about it is he needs to be able to follow through on a, on a blank turn. I agree. So there's going to be a lot of blanks coming, and you're going to have to keep repping your story. This has to that's, be it. He, that's he has to put it all. Yeah, he has to put it all in the middle. He does have about a pot size bet, and he oh, does, and he does go, go for it. I like that very much. So it's very hard. He's denying all equity from ace kings, ace jacks, seven sixes. I Man, if he play. makes it. If he makes this call, I may just leave the booth. I'll be honest with you. I believe he did make the call. No, no, he folded. No, he did fold. Shout out to Sobrino there in seat four. Wow. Taking down the nice one. The ace high. Well played, well played, well played. I really like that play. I like the sizing. Left. <coughs> Left himself with a pot sized bet. Really, really well played. Uh, the sizing of the flop really allowed him to to deny equity with that sh shove on the turn. So, I agree. being able to uh, bluff once takes a lot of courage. Bluffing twice, pulling the trigger, and following through with your story is the real exclamation point, right? Anybody can bluff, anybody can throw a bet out there. But to throw a bet out there, knowing you're probably beat, or knowing that you don't have a made hand yet, that well, I like is... the I, I like the fact that he led what he led on the flop, and the fact that Heavy just flatted him, because I think if Heavy had any over pairs, he would have would have got it in right there and then. Um, yes and no. I, I if you have a guy leading into you, you have aces. You're not scared of two pairs of anything else. So, if he has, if you have aces there, kings, I like flatting because you're going to allow him to bet again on the turn. True that. If you raise that, you 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 fold out all his bluffs, right? You fold out all his flush draws, all his all his things like that. If you make a big raise, so you allow him to to dictate the action when you're holding 
a strong enough hand that's very hard to be beat. You're only going to lose to a, to, a, to a turn set, you know what I mean? Or he, I mean, he could have also wanted to bet his aces to deny equity on the flush draw had Sobrino had a flush draw, right? Definitely, yeah, definitely. So that's <coughs> that's, the, that's the beauty of poker. He can play a hand ten different ways, and it's the right way, or ten different ways, and it's the wrong way. That's the beauty of uh, poker. You know what I mean? There's no. It's such a game of incomplete information. Then we fill out. And we've got to put the pieces of the puzzle together to make the best possible decision. Snow Angel taking down a, a little pot there. I don't know, but the, I'm, I might start writing some Hallmark cards. I felt that was a bar there. Give me give me that. You have a, I believe, a ten dollar button straddle out there by JMK. Excellent on Baby Spider, electing to make the call out of the small blind. So it'll be inviting Elude, who's in the big blind with the seven five off, to make the call. Jackie Moon getting in there with the nine eight of hearts. And Heavy, who's got to be up there on the V-Pipping with the Jack-4 off, wants to see a flop as well. <laughs> off to a flop of Ace-Jack-10, Rainbow. My apologies, guys. We are lagging on my end, so just stay patient with us as much as possible. I did see somebody fold. I do see a bet. I can't tell you who it is or how much is, is out there. Ghosts. Check, check. Jackie Moon with the bet. Heavy making the call. Action back around to JMK. Did we notice that Baby Spider added some glasses to his repertoire? I did not. Just seen that now. Looking like, looks like he went from Spider Man to Cyclops with those glasses. Off to a turn of the Queen of Diamonds we go. Heads up. Check, check. Queen of Clubs on the river. Can Jackie Moon, Queen Jack 10. Jackie Moon does have the bottom end straight. Bet fold. Reward the pot to Jackie Moon. Guys, we do have a 25K Bad Beat Jackpot here at Texas Card House RGV running all month. Lose with a straight flush or bet. Lose with a straight flush to qualify. Both whole cards must play. $25 min pot required. So make your way over. We have all kinds of promos running this month. I see one straddle. I see two straddles. Let's, let's go. Big, big pot. One, one straddle, time. Straddle, restraddle. Straddle, restraddle. Saddle. Yeah. Let's get it in. I'm surprised John Dre, the Cajun Asian, didn't put that re restraddle. It's because I don't think he likes Rihanna. Potential. Does make the fold. Action on snow. Little chip trick, little chip trick. Little TV time. Yeah, never hurt nobody. Our resident magician. Does he make Damn. his chips disappear? 
JMK raising it to 80. Elude with the 10 8. And the small blind electing to make the call. I like it. Has some money already invested. Has suited one gappers. Javi with the 5 3 offsuit making the call as well. Heavy coming in heavy, riding a Chevy. A shadow. <laughs> I don't shadow electing to a fold. Getting hiding in the shadows. Three ways to a flop, we're gonna go. 10 8 King. Loot, elude, smashing the board. Check, check, buddy. Don't, oh, no, no. Let the pre flop. Oh, no. Dude, we got a check. Cake hold in here. I do see that he has a queen of diamonds. Could be, can be the king, queen of diamonds. Could be the king, queen offsuit. Be Could queen be the jack. queen, jack. Yeah, yeah. Queen, jack of diamonds. Get him some action. Could be the ace, queen. I really like a check from Elude to let JMK continue the lead and then come in with a raise. Really make him feel the pain. Backdoor diamonds if he has another diamond back there. Which is very likely. I would like to see a bigger size bet on the turn. Yeah, deny equity definitely for the ace queens. There's he's just getting almost three and a half to one on his money. I like Elude. a call here. Elu does bet two seventy five. Action on JMK. Makes the call. We're going to go heads up to a river. Pot over $1,100 now. Let's see what this river brings. Very interesting. Just knowing one card. Oh, oh baby. Ten of diamonds. Potential danger. Elude shoves. JMK calls. I'm going to assume JMK had the queen jack of diamonds here. It was an all in and a snap call. JMK about to see the bad news. He does have the ace queen of diamonds. So that his money card was Elude's money card. Yikes. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Ten in the clubs. My favorite hand. Showing it some love in the in the live stream. Well played. Nice hand, Elude. Unfortunate for JMK to go runner, runner, diamonds. In his mind, he was licking his chops. But Elude was already chopping up his chops. Uh-oh. Bar City. Nice pot. Over 2,100 in the middle. Going to Elude. Well played, sir. God, the 10 yeah. clubs are so beautiful. Bada bing, bada boom, right? It's nice to hit that river and that river that helps your opponent. If that's not run good, I don't know what is. Yeah, that's that's best case scenario for him for sure. JMK's the V pip is the highest <laughs> after twenty nine hands. Snow is the tightest, but he's also down the most. So it's a twisted web we weave here, you know. When you're down the most, but you play the le the least amount of hands. Yeah, for sure. I know we have been in talks about potentially getting a VPIP game going, guys. So stay tuned. We will be doing something like that here soon. I agree. I, I think it's, uh, it's something that should be done. It's something that will entice action and something that will give multiple people multiple ways to get on the stream. That being said, I, I think if we do that, our stream has to be longer for sure. To allow more people to get in on it. I agree. Let's go, Chad. Elude does have a button straddle. Action to Sobrino, who does make the fold. He's coming around to Jackie Moon with the 7 3 offsuit. Hand finds its way into the muck. Heavy, but the second highest V pip of tonight so far, does make the call with the 87 off. You call that the Gronkowski. Andre getting in there. And whoa, lo and behold, what do you know? Mr. Run Good Elude with two Jackersons, the two Michael Jacksons on the straddle, 
raises it up to 50. But I could go a little bigger, entice everyone to get in on the action. Does get called in both spots. Heavy flopping a gut shot and a flush draw. No, no flush draw, I'm sorry. Check, check. Elude leads out for 125. Heavy's going to make the call, I believe. Oh, no. Does it go fold, fold? It, it does go, go fold, fold, fold. Once again, Chad, I do apologize to the people at home. We are on a bit of a lag. We are having technical difficulties. It is only our second week on stream. Please be patient with us, guys. Baby Spider electing to raise with the Queen Four of Clubs, making it 75 to go. Oh, wow. I thought he left the stream. Hadn't heard from him. Heavy making the call with the walking sticks, pocket sevens. Action on Jandre. Putting the 10 8 off. Who said he's done folding and does elect to make the call as well. Action back on the snowman. Folds. JMK, our most active player with the 8-9 of hearts. Going to see a flop. Does elect to make the call. We're going to go four ways to a flop here. Six three three, two clubs. Insta shove from heavy, saying, "My sevens are good enough." Pre tips the dealer, untucks the shirt. I'm, he's exuding confidence. Action back around to Baby Spider, who was a pre flop aggressor with the Queen Four of Clubs, does flop a flush draw and does make the call. If he wasn't if he wasn't wearing the glasses, I think he wouldn't have raised the Queen Four. To be honest with you. They mess with his vision? I think so. 1,600 in the middle. And just like that, king of clubs right on the turn. Spot, uh, looking for a seven or a three. Hello, club. Are oh, they going to run it twice? They did elect to run it twice. Lid is off. Off to a delayed turn. Hmm. If you heard that, they're asking, did you <coughs> did you raise 75 with that pre-flop, Chris? That was pretty funny. Hello, stranger, my old friend. Definitely not a singer, Leo. Definitely not a singer, buddy. Um, let's stick to just winning $15,000 tournaments, buddy. <laughs> Sign me up. <laughs> What's going on here? A little bit of a delay. We 
are having technical difficulties. Once again, chat, my apologies. Those at home, my apologies. The chat has gone silent. Let's get some more hype in the chat. Let's get some more viewers. Let's spread the word. This beautiful Friday evening, we get to be here and get to play some poker. Come on, poker community. Let's get it rallied. Let's get it going. Take a minute. Go ahead and invite those, those at home or watching around on their phone. Make it out here onto the main floor. We do have a couple of tables running of 1-3 and potentially other other games i'm not too sure but i have seen traffic increase throughout the night shout out to alexis the gallito and Kyle, we are sorry. We are having some technical difficulties. My apologies. Ace of hearts on the churn, three of clubs on the river. These guys will be chopping the pot. Would have been nice for some max pain. Do have a chopped pot, guys. So to recap really quick, guys, there was a pause there because the floor was called. They were just making sure they were able to run it twice. A little bit of technical difficulties with the RFDI reader. No, no no big deal unfortunately both ended chopping and we all know what they say <laughs> chopping a pot is like kissing your kissing sister. sister so we're back to the action now everything got fixed everything's back everything's ready to rock and roll to finish these last two hours of the stream so let's get it popping So we got Jackie Moon with a $10 button straddle. Action will be on heavy, holding the 9-8 of clubs. Going to get in there like swimwear. Like I like to say, John Dre, 6-5 off. Let's it go. Was at a discounted rate. Action on Snow, who elects to raise with the King-10 off. Shadow folding. JMK, JMK folding. Baby Spider making the call out of the low jack with the 6-7. Bringing in Elude, holding jack-5 of spades with the hijack. And Sobrino in the cutoff coming in as well with the queen-7 of clubs. Gonna go to a flop five ways. King, queen, five, rainbow. Snow, flopping top pair. Making a bet and taking down the pot. It's 
been relatively quiet tonight. With that, with that tight image, of, not many people were going to defend. You know, they're knowing how tight he's been playing all, all stream. We do have either a fifteen or twenty dollar button straddle out there by heavy. Action will be on John during the small blind. Using my toes and fingers, I think it's 15. It is 15. John Dre making the fold. Snow electing to make the call. Action is on Shadow. Snow with the ace five off, making the call. Shadow with the jack four off, makes the call. So Brino getting in there, ace nine off. Jackie Moon letting his hand go. Action back around to heavy. Who does raise to 65 <laughs> in position with the button straddle? Action now on on Snow holding the Ace Five offsuit. Makes the fold. Action back on Shadow. Yeah, for your style. <laughs> <laughs> I believe Shadow made the call. <laughs> Does want to see a flop. Three-handed going to a flop. Off to a deuce, deuce, deuce board. Potentially no help to anyone. Shadow checks. Sobrino checks. Heavy checks. Off to a turn we go. Eight of hearts. I know that heavy at least has one eight. Does turn a full house. Should go bet, fold, fold. Heavy patting his stack. Have an upfront straddle by JMK. Looks like 20. No, it looks like 10 with a restraddle to 20 and a restraddle to 40. Game is out of the muck and there will be blood. Dear Poker God, thank you for answering my prayers. All I've ever wanted was big pots at the Texas Card House RGV. In your name always, Poker Gods. Amen. Amen. Action will be on Sobrino. Sobrino raise to a hundred. 
There is dead money out there. All the pre-flop restraddles. I would like to see a little bigger race from Sorino, especially under the gun, uh, with so much dead money out there. Heavy with the king queen, really making a big fold as he likes to splash around in some pots. Action back around to JMK. 10 9 folds. Should get through. Oh no, he does have a call by Shadow with the Jack 8 of Hearts. He, they are going to see a flop. Heads up, guys. Off to a flop we go. Queen 9 deuce, two hearts. Can flop much better from Shadow than that. Shadow, open shoving. 133. To a $400 pot. So Brino making the call. I think he has two, two aces. Two aces. He does look like he has American Airlines. So Brino has outs. I mean, Shadow has outs. He has jacks, eights, and hearts, guys. I do prefer Southwest if we're being totally honest. <laughs> Queen of Diamonds on the turn. Three of Clubs on the river. They did elect to run it twice. Half that pot's going up to Sobrino. And the Ace on the river. Ace of Hearts giving Shadow the flush. Ho, oh, baby! Well, a lot of false hope there. Some chop chops. Man, I want to see some blood. I want to see some Max Payne run it once. Let's get the gloves and the Vaseline and the ice bags ready. And let's make it happen. My boy is thirsty for blood. They want to suck your blood. Call me Dracula. We do have about another hour and change of stream time, guys. Make your way over to Card House. Get on the list. We will be playing post-stream. So the game will be running. Make your way over. We do have high hands. We have a 25K bad beat jackpot. It does pay to play here at Texas Card House RGB. Andre, the call with the king nine. Shadow getting in there. Queen Jack offsuit. JMK, we're going to go four ways to a flop. Jack 10 five, rainbow board. Action is on Shadow. Top pair, decent kicker. Does bet 15, does fold around to Jondre holding the king nine for a gutty. The Cajun Asian, relatively quiet today. Eight of diamonds on the turn. Both players looking for one another's outs. One another card, sorry about that. Check, check, off to a river. Seven of diamonds. I know, Jimbo's itching over there. He's like. Jondre does get there on the river. Interesting yeah. the way this hand played out, I believe, Randy. I have felt like there should be more money in this pot. There should be a lot bigger bit, uh, of a pot. I'm assuming Shadow went for pot control. <laughs> on the turn but I think he should have led pot 
That's just my opinion. But like I say, it's easier in here than it is out there. Chandra bets 38 on the river and Shadow calls. She's the bad news. Chandra breaking the ice, getting some morale back. <laughs> Shout out to all the wonderful staff here at Texas Card House RGB. From the moment you walk in to the moment you make your way to the tables and on, even on your way out. Wonderful staff. Shout outs to Kayla in the cage. I see a 10 and a 20, buddy. I see a $10 and a $20 straddle. I see Jackie Moon with 10s. All right, chat. Get the big pot hype going. LFG. Let's freaking go. Jackie Moon, pocket tens, raising, electing to make a raise to $60. Action on heavy, goes ahead and lets it go. Dondre folds. Snow folds. Shadow folds. A couple of folds making its way down to Baby Spider with the 5-3 suited. You never saw two suited cards you didn't like? Defending his big blind. He will be out there riding speeding tickets. Bro, I'll never forget the day I went to your apartment. The dude's fucking mad. So Brino making the call. We went three ways to a flop. Ace, queen, seven. Check, check, check. Off to a turn we go. I believe it's the king of clubs. Baby spider. Bada bing, bada boom. Hello, club. I see a call coming from Jackie Moon with a gutty and a 10 high flush draw. I believe so. It's about a half pot, half pot bet there by Baby Spider of 130. Started off hot, relatively quiet over the last 45 minutes or so. Sobrino makes the fold. Jackie Moon's going to let those tens go. Shriveled up on that flop after after that flop. Sorry about that. It does look like um, almost every buddy is straddling at this point. So there will be action throughout the night, guys. And once again, I want to go ahead and thank you guys for tuning in tonight on this Friday afternoon with us here at Texas Card House RGV, where we will be hosting a 2-5 Hold'em game every Friday. Get on the list. Work, make your way out here. And let me go ahead and let everybody know the list is an interest list guys so we will be in contact with most players if we don't get you on this stream or the next we will be working doing our best and working players throughout the stream so everybody gets a chance go ahead and add yourself on poker atlas two five fridays we also do have one three on wednesdays <laughs> Off to a dealer change, and we have a $20 button straddle by JMK. 
So, you know where the, 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 the Jackson and University, right? So it's like the juniors here, and it's like some little like ghetto food, like ghetto like little uh, market store, and it's and then it's Peter Piper and Donald, right? That little, Got a twenty dollar button straddle now. Let's see if this kicks up the action a little bit. Again, guys, make your way out to Houston, our Texas card house, Houston, for the Poker Atlas tour. There is, from April 10th through April 22nd, there is 16 events, over a million dollars in guarantees. Put it in your calendar and work your way out there, guys. Back to the action. We do have uh, either a ten or fifteen dollar button straddle by Baby Spider, and the action will be on the lewd. Couple of folds. Action on snow. King nine off. Raises to fifty. Does have a tight image right now. Should be beneficial post flop. JMK with the raise. Three betting to two hundred. Snow folds. JMK taking down another little pot. Do feel as if we are on a round of button straddles. Everybody has been putting in a button straddle. Let's we'll see how long it goes. $10 button straddle actions on heavy does make the call with the jack nine offsuit John Dre raising with the ace queen off folds around 
I thought the first time they did to me, I was like, wow, I got lucky. I got the one Actions back to the button straddle, who does let it go, and Heavy lets it go. Jandre picking up a $77 pot uncontested. They tell me, like, you know, that I can I don't know why, but I feel the action has slowed down a little bit. I feel the same. It has slowed down, guys. We, uh, I thought once people were getting more comfortable, we see more chips flying. The more comfortable they get, I feel like the more talking they're doing than playing. Maybe I have to go in there and give them a little pep talk. Send a round of drinks in there. Loosen them up. I'll be right back. Straddle, button straddle does continue as Sabrino has about $10 out there. Action will be on Jackie Moon. Jackie Moon folds heavy, making the call to Jack Three of Hearts. John Dre and Snow releasing Shadow making the call as well. Action around the baby spider with the queen six of hearts in the hijack. Did put his mask on and make it 65 to go. The Lude makes the call and the cutoff with the seven eight of diamonds. Does fold around and we will be going heads up to a flop. Nine three deuce. Elude flopping a flush draw. Baby spider squad deuce does have some backdoor outs. Does have a backdoor flush draw. Potential. Bets out, baby spider bets out 75. He's telling the story. Lude's not buying. Does make the call. Jack of spades on the turn. It is interesting to see what's going to happen here. Baby spider does elect to check. I do think Elude will make a bet. He does bet. He does bet heavy. He does pet pot size 350 on the turn. Taking down the pot. Nice hand to Lude. Yet again, we do have another button straddle. I believe, I feel like we do have maybe a round of straddles going on. Couldn't tell you for certain. <laughs> we does have ten dollars out there, and action will be on heavy. Heavy making the call with the 7 4 off. Jandre getting in there with the 6 7. As that'll bring in Snow with the Jack 10 offsuit and bringing in Shadow, King 10 of Hearts. Oh, I'm lying. Shadow raising, min clicking it to 20. Bringing in Sobrino, King Jack off. Heavy completing, Dondre completing, and Snow completing. We will be seeing the RGV special. We will be going to a flop. Queen nine deuce. Snow with an open ender. 
Shadow with a gutty. Sobrino with a gutty. Bet, call, call. Off to a turn we go. King of Diamonds. Oh, or he's good. Why do you go good Snow with the lock on this hand. Checks. Getting Shadow to put out 35. And Sobrino making the call with both with top pair and gut shots. the bad news for them there is a raise wait what he does elect to go all in okay wait three folded right shadow in the tank does have top pair and a oh, gut yeah. shot. <coughs> did put 35 out there. Does complete. He did have 121 behind. Does make the call. He will be seeing all five. Sabrina releasing. Heads up to the river. And he does get a jack for the chop. What a hand to come back to, Randy. Coming back to another chop pot. You know what they say about chop pots? That is crazy. So you did have um, Snow, who did turn the nuts and did a check shove. Got them to put all the money in. They are having some kind of talk about maybe potentially running the river twice. I'm not sure exactly what happened, but there is something happening. They did do the river twice. Which will probably more than likely end up in a quarter. We'll end up with a quarter. Quarter pot. Snow quartering Shadow. It's unfortunate. Shadow did get there on the first board. Sorry about that, guys. Let me go ahead and show you guys our 25K Bad Beat jackpot here that we do have here at Texas Card House, Rio Grande Valley. Lose with a straight flush to qualify. Both whole cards must play $25 minimum pot requirement. And that will be running throughout the whole month of April, along with the $100 high hand progressive rollovers from 9 a.m. to 2 a.m., guys. So make your way over and play here at Texas Card House. It does pay to play. Randy, does that only that 25,000 bad beat is only for Texas Card House RGV? That is only here in Texas Card House RGV. Every card house, every sister card house does host its own promotions, guys. We do encourage anybody here in the Rio Grande Valley who does like to play or loves to play poker to come out and enjoy our wonderful card room along with the chance to win free money, right? Who doesn't love free money? Free money is good money. So my mama bear always said. It's like never passing up a free meal. That's right. That's, what, that's why I am the way. World. Yes, sir. And when it's out there, you better believe to get up and go out there and take it. <laughs> Two five actions on shadow with the A6 of spades. I want to say he's probably kicking himself from the previous hand. 
did make the call, did get there on the first river, and ultimately ended up getting quartered because of the second run out. <laughs> Shadow does race to 20, so Brino makes a call with the queen five of spades. Actions on Jackie Moon holding King Jack of Diamonds, who I believe is going to just make the call. I'm not going to eat my words again. Action out to Heavy. Does make the three bet with the ace, ten of hearts. Makes it 70. Does have the power. He is on the button, guys. Power, I mean button. Gets a couple of folds. Actions back around to Shadow. Rips it. His last 258. Cabrino releases. Action back to Jackie Moon. Goes ahead and releases. Heavy does make the call, and we are going to go heads up to see all five. Ace 10. Dominating the A6 of Shadow. It gets a little tough to navigate a short stack in a 2-5 game, in my opinion. What's your opinion, Leo? Yeah, it's you're really caught between a rock and a hard place, trying to see hands that you want to see flops with, but also not trying to give up any equity and any possible full equity when you do get a monster. It's it's very, very difficult in a lot of spots. You're going to be put in a lot of difficult situations because you're so handcuffed with a short stack. 10 on the turn for Heavy to <coughs> secure half of the pot. Better? Oh, six on the river. They will be chopping, guys. Hello, six. This is maybe our feel like our 10th hand that we've chopped tonight. I sound like a broken record, but when you chop a pot, it really feels like you're kissing your sister. <laughs> wow, three outs, one time on the river, no big deal. I feel like Shadow has a lot of lives. Well, he did pick up quarter outs on the second board, right? So Correct, and flush drawouts. And some flush drawouts. But still, I just feel like he has alligator blood. He has alligator blood for sure. Shout out, shout out to all the players in today's stream game, guys. Um, we really do appreciate that you guys are reaching out to us, adding your name to the list, and coming out here and enjoying playing these games. I enjoy I enjoy doing the commentary for this action along with the co-host here, Leo. Life is great. We get to be around the poker community on a Friday night. What what else can you ask for? It's a it's a blessing, definitely a blessing to be allowed with this opportunity. And you know, I like to take a uh, take a chance now to thank everybody that's involved with this production. It, it, it takes a lot and. It's not just us calling the action, not just the players, it's the dealers, the staff, the servers, the floors, the people behind the scenes. It's literally a whole bunch of moving parts and we do the easy job of just calling what we see. So thanks to everyone that's making this possible for me and I'm sure I'm speaking for Randy as well. Yes, sir. Thank you guys. Let's get active in the chat, guys. Let's get active. Baby Spider holding the Ace Queen off, raising the 25. Jackie Moon can only see one of his cards. It's the 10 of clubs, and he does make a three bet. Heavy. To 80. Oh, baby. Heavy waking up to the black aces. I guess my pep talk helped. He does elect to just call. Sneaky, sneaky. I'm seeing Heavy making the call there. He does know, he does play quite a bit with some of these guys. He does know Baby Spider is a bit on the aggressive side. He might be doing it to induce a bigger bet from him, which we are going to see. 
There it is. Baby Spider for betting to 325. I do like the play by Heavy. I like a call here. I don't know what the stack depth is, but I can't see it. 900. Yeah. Like Heavy's flat. holding 930. Yeah, I like a spider. flat. I like a flat because we know Baby Spider is going to see bet a lot of Mike saying 95% of his hands. I do like a flat as well. I would love for, for Heavy to flat continue, and yeah, continue with this slow play. Especially with such an uh, active and aggressive player like Baby Spider. Don't do it. And he does elect to make the call, and we will be seeing a flop. So right now, if you're Baby Spider, I, I I would be ranging him anything between sevens to jacks. Jacks. Yep. Yeah, sixes to jacks, sevens, more than likely sevens. Some ace kings, some ace jack suited, some king queen suited. He's at the Broadway minimum. heavy for sure. Broadway heavy, and I'm gonna go ahead and say from jacks to eights, I'd probably be letting sixes and sevens go. But from jacks to eights, is it gonna be the set mining for sure? Definitely, definitely. Relatively safe board. Backdoor hearts for spider. Goes check check. Wow, interesting play by heavy. He's setting up to get all the money in. Ooh, I think that 10, I think uh, Jackie Moon folded 10, if I'm not mistaken, if I saw in the RFP. He did fold a 10. I'm not sure on the second card. The bet from Spider here doesn't really make sense. Um, he put 240 out there. It's about a third, 30% uh, of the pot, maybe. A yeah, a little less. less. I just don't see what he's betting turn if he didn't bet flop with after three. Yeah, unless you just smashed the 10, right? Yeah, so you, his hand is really condensed. The pocket 10s, ace 10, jack 10, suited 10, 9, suited, which. Heavy should continue his slow play by just calling. Because I don't think I don't... Heavy is just going to call, though. My opinion is he's just going to... He's ready. He doesn't like it. He doesn't like the hards. He already is not sure. I, he needs to find out more, Some get some more info, in my opinion. Very likely. Very likely. And, and it's, it wouldn't be a terrible play. I just feel you slow play this much. I don't see this board really helping Baby Spider. Unless he has 10s, like I said. So I, I could like to flat play, and I like to see Baby Spider blast off on the river and, and just getting called off by heavy. Hundred. Heavy is. Applying for a job in Hollywood. He is in the tank. Coach going into the ninth seat, five hundred and seventy dollars behind. Yep. Once again, guys, shout out to those at home tuning Good. in, joining Good. us. Yeah. We do Sounds have good. about well, another hour and change on stream. Great. Uh, just when uh, nine seats sits down, welcome them to the table, guys. We got Coach Tuman here coming in. Uh, hey, got it. Coach five seventy. I heard that all the way over here, Leo. What happened? What did I miss? Baby Spider taking it down. Wait a minute. I think there was a misread in the on the cards. I saw Ace King. Offsuit. I did see Ace King offsuit as well. So he didn't have aces. <laughs> as Ace Ventura would say. Guys. Wow. I don't. I'm not sure what happened there. I'm gonna 
take a break, Leo. Leave you for a little bit. You got it, buddy. Ten dollar straddle now. No, I know. She went off. If she went off all season, but like she's averaging thirty two a game. Pull up like that, like maybe once you like catch this. Yeah, but not the start of the game. Yeah, that's how you get the whole time. So Brino with the three dues, making the call. Wait, so I have you count for a sword for a half, right? <laughs> Heavy with the ace five offsuit, making a race to 40. John Dre in the cutoff. Electing the muck. The ace four. JMK has been quiet ever since that big pot we played earlier. Chris, the glasses baby spider, he's out there with the queen eight offsuit. We got the RGB special now. Lots of players to the flop. Let's see what it brings. Ten eight five two diamonds. Middle pair for Baby Spider, bottom pair for Heavy. So Brina with the nut low now, going to lead here and try to take this pot down. Baby Spider raising to 175. It's going to be too much heat for both players. They're going to fold. Baby Spider is going to pad his stack with 137 extra dollars. Unique now coming in with the $10 straddle. Action's going to be on Sorbina to open it up. Again, we apologize for the lag. Doing our best to give you the play-by-play. -play. Something we are working on tirelessly to get fixed for you guys. We appreciate you all in the chat. Watching us live all over all these platforms. Jackie Moon with the King Jack offsuit. Coming in for a raise. I apologize, the King Jack was not a raise, it was a fold. We have a raise from Heavy. Seven, eight, seven on the flop, two diamonds. Heavy with the flush draw, elude with six high, snow with eight high. Heavy's in a bet. Heavy's gonna win. Nice answer. Doyle Brunson thanks you. He's high fiving you from the grave. Yeah, 
Got a button straddle now, also known as the Mississippi straddle. Small black will be first to act here. Baby Spider with the 4 3 of diamonds. He's out there with a call. Elude makes the call with the King 6. Uh, Jackie Moon with the A7 throws out $65, trying to narrow the field down a little bit. We're not doing okay, but sure. Heads up now Baby Spider versus Jackie Moon. A7 of spades versus the 4-3 of diamonds. 2-3 queen. Baby spider with middle pair. Jackie Moon with ace high. Baby spider doesn't like folding. Checks his options over to Jackie Moon. Jackie Moon continues with a C bets of 45. We got a bet and a call. Gonna going two to the turn now. Two hundred and forty already in this pot, with mediocre holdings at best. Jack of Hearts now on the turn. Brings a check from Baby Spider. Jackie Moon continues his aggression with a $110 bet. Baby Spider says, I will not be pushed around and makes the call with third pair. Going to a river now. We're heads up. Final card coming. Jack on the river pairs the board. Goes check, check. Baby Spider shows his three. Takes the pot down. Nice pot, baby spider, nice pot. You win the chips and the button. Ten dollar straddle from Jackie Moon. Let's see if we get the double straddle from Heavy. My prayers are answered. Double straddle coming from heavy. We got the 5. We got the 10. We got the 20. Ho, baby. Let's get that big pot energy going. Everybody in the chat, everybody watching, let's get it going. Big pot energy. One time. We got the 10. We got the 20 on. Shadow shoves in 141 with the ace nine offsuit. Sabrina reluctantly makes the call with the yeah. queen ten. Gonna see the good news. Gonna be at 60 40 here. If we're a tournament, we'd have to win 60 40 to win a tournament, guys. So, probably the best news for Sabrina is to see the ace nine. Two live cards. Gonna see five now. 
So Brendan Q20 like this, he may be able to afford another chain. Back to the action. We have Shadow all in with the Ace Nine offsuit. Heavy making the call with the Ace Jack. We are gonna see all five. Hey, I want to go to Dallas to announce too. Whenever you want me, I'm ready. I don't work at Dallas, but I got. You. Where do you work? Las Colinas. <laughs> Where's that? Fifteen minutes down the road from Dallas. <laughs> Shit. I actually off to a flop. We go of ten seven seven. <laughs> Three on the turn. Six of diamonds. Not enough. Heavy will be getting rewarded the pot. Alligator blood is done. GG's to Shadow. Thanks for coming out, buddy. No, we do have some people on the list uh, that are going to come in, and we will be bringing them in. So stay patient. And see yeah. who we're going to get. Yes. Yeah. 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 Elude with a $10 button straddle. Action will be on the small blind. Give it up for a shadow, guys. Good showing today. Just ran into some tough tough situations and some tough luck. Well, we will be sitting another player. His name's Coach. Going to welcome into the stream. Coach? The, he's a Puerto Rican boxing trainer, I believe. Rolando uh, no, okay. did play last week. Can you hear me now? You miss me or no? Did get jiggy with it. Huh? I'm not talking on there. Action on Sobrino. King seven suited. Does make the call. Jackie Moon holding the jiggities, as Brad Owen says it. Alexa, make the call as well. He's got bad intentions. A couple of folds around. Action on Baby Spider. Does make a fold. Elude checks. A7 off. Three handed going to a flop. Queen, queen, nine. Should be checked around here. Turn. Four of spades. Jackie Moon bets 20. Sabrino making the call with the king seven. Head up to a river. Ace of diamonds. Sabrino could potentially steal this pot if he does make a bet. No, but it does go check, check, and Sabrino will see the bad news. Jackie Moon taking down the pot, pocket jacks. Once again, guys, I want to go ahead and thank you guys for tuning in on this Friday night. We do host 2-5 Hold'em every Friday night on stream. Put your name on the list. Get with our general manager, Danny, or any one of our floors. Jump on that list. Let them know you're interested in playing. and We will do our best in getting you on to one of either next stream or the one after. We have been getting a lot of interest, and we are trying to work everybody in. So... 
Let us know how interested you are. I like to take the time as let you guys know we do have early bird bonus all week long through the month of April. Two for one. Hundred dollar max. Must be purchased at the desk, and we do have half time price all week long as well from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. You will be playing on half time, guys. The most expected value you will receive. The rounds of straddles looks like they slowed down. Yeah, no, I know that. But he's going to say, like, oh, oh yeah. he's going to assume that he doesn't yeah. play aces like that. Yeah. Elude with the queen eight suited. Opening it up to 30. Get Sobrino to call with the nine eight of diamonds. I like Elude's play as of today. He's mixed it up well. Had some good and bad hands mixed it up. I really like the way he's playing. He's, and he's a partner in a decent stack. I agree. He's not afraid to put chips in there either. He he does like big pots. so Definitely, yeah. That, that That's what makes it very, very interesting and hard to arrange, you know? Up to a Jack-Jack 10 flop, guys. Coach, the only person with the with the jack, I believe. So Brino's open ended. Is that who I think I see? Partner? It is. It is partner. Making a fashionably late appearance. And a debut here on Texas Card House RGV live stream. Shout outs to him. Like I say, guys, if you are interested in playing, make your way over, add your name to the poker list, the poker atlas list, and we will do our best to get you on stream. If not on this stream, future streams, guys. The stream may not be the same after this, guys. Let's be honest. With partner joining the mix, uh, I'm predicting some fireworks. I'm predicting some heavy bloodshed. I'm predicting a lot of fun. Let's finish this stream off with with a bang, you know? Bang, bang. <laughs> so, Coach does race the 35. Elude calls and Sobrino calls. Elude and Sobrino both on straight draws. Four of spades on the churn. Bad card for everyone. Coach with three jacks and the only one holding a spade. Should go check around. Does go check around. Eight on the river. Locking up the half of Coach who does bet and does win. Welcome to the table, Coach. Nice hand. Jackie Moon trying to get some type of um, something going. I believe he's pushing for a $25 button straddle. At least one round should get the game out of the muck. 
Shots out to Trino, who bought wings for the entire floor, people on the floor today. Jackie Moon, I believe, has a $25. 18 or 25? Looks like 25. There it is, right out the gates. Partner opening it up, making it 75 with the 7-4 of hearts. I mean, that's a strong holding, too, let's be honest. That's premium for partner's range. My man, coach, any two will do, making the call with the 10-8 off. JMK, who was really active earlier, and still wants to see all of them and is taxing the entire stack with the ace-king off. Action folds around back to partner on his first hand. I wonder what coach is a coach of. Do you, you know that, Randy? I do. He is a, a boxing trainer. A boxing trainer. Shots out to him. That's a, he's in seat nine, correct? Yes, he's in seat nine. He has, uh, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, he has trained uh, a world heavyweight boxing champion. So, I mean, I've trained to be a box. I trained to be a heavyweight, so we, we would get along <laughs> for sure. We do got wings out on the main floor, buddy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Partner says, "No guts, no glory." Says, "If I raise, I'm calling, protecting his seventy-five dollar raise." Definitely oh baby makes the call with the seven four of hearts and he says one time baby max Payne on your it. friday night two five hold him stream first hand right out of the gate and he does out flop jmk oh baby just a seven he does have some outs though king spade or an ace Partner dodging the world says one time, my seven's good. I'm going to double up. $1,455 pot going over to partner. Ho, baby. Welcome to the stream. He's one for one. He's betting a 1000 I would just quit if I was him. Hello, stranger. My old friend. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? what? Why? Oh. There we go. Pump fake. Let's mess with the announcers. Juan just throwing us a curveball. Looked like he was going one way, but it's really going the other way. You got the best of both worlds right now. I get to watch what I like to watch, what I love to watch in poker, right? And uh, watching the Yukon women's and Iowa game going at it. Oh, que padre vida. Sick brag. I'm over here staring at the wall, counting... How many tiles are in the season? I'll keep you updated. UConn has 30 and Iowa has 26. How's Caitlin playing? I haven't. I just started watching. It's been oh. on, but I wasn't watching. Um, I was more interested in this game that we got going on here. I don't want to see blood on a Friday night. Uh, let's get back to those wings, buddy. What kind of wings do, are out there? Not sure, but I did kill quite a bit of them. Some... Are, are you a boneless or a bone in? No, they're traditional, buddy. And and either way, I wouldn't mind. They were free. I'm take. I'll take either one. Mama always said, "Free food is tastes better." Partner coming in and creating action on his very first hand. That should set a. A president for sure. A president for the rest of the table and letting them know I'm here and I'm here to play. No gamble, no future, baby. Definitely something that we should we should keep into our arsenal here is uh, he's going to use that for future. You know, you is just, it seven for him? Just gave him extra ammunition, baby. I'm excited to see how this last hour of the stream plays out, guys. Once again, I want to thank everybody for tuning in and watching us on a Friday night. Did JMK reload? I believe so. I believe so. 
Partner waking up with the jack six of clubs. We are on a bit of a lag, guys. We are having te technical difficulties, but we will be getting all that settled in. So please be patient and work with us. <laughs> so we got a race of 20 from Baby Spider. So Bruno called with a four and a napkin and two other callers. We're going to the RGV special. Let's see what this brings. Four ten eight rainbow, middle pair for heavy, bottom pair for Sobrino, king high for baby spider, the funi fa for partner. Let's see how this plays out. Shout out to all those in the chat. Get those chat ninjas. Ten eight four check check. Deuce of diamonds on the churn. No help to no one. Nine of clubs on the river. Ace four, queen eight. Heavy should be taking down this pot. Will be taking down the pot. Had in the stack with $162. Any win is a good win. Don't matter how ugly it is, as long as you're raking in the pot, you're doing something right. Got about an hour left, Randy. Let's Hope and pray for some big pots here. Adding the dynamic of some new players that don't like folding should really ump up the stream and the pots and splashing. Fingers crossed. $25 button straddle is on for at least one round. One the table orbit. has agreed, yep. So. $32 now in the pot. John Dre, $25 button straddle. Action's on partner holding the 10 3 of diamonds. Oh, John Dre's still here? Jeez, this guy's been super quiet. The Cajun Asian. The raging Cajun. Not, not raging today. Oh, no, no, definitely not. The jambalaya is not hot tonight. Coach making the call with the 7 8 offsuit. Defending his big blind. Action folding around to Sobrino, who has pocket tens. I like to see a a nice size raise here, but he likes to make a call. Jackie Moon making the call with the six four of clubs. Entices and is going to <coughs> definitely bring in heavy holding the king nine of hearts. Jandre checking the jack. RGV special, baby. Let's get the dealer to pick me, pick me, pick me. A772 spades. Coach flopping the trippers. The so problem is nobody's holding an ace. I would have liked to check. Definitely don't like to lead here. A little premature for me to lead out. Leads like 15. It should fold around. Yeah. Coach taking down that pot. When he re-sees this on stream, he's going to kick himself. I think if he checks, so Bruno makes a bet, to be honest with you. At least a stab. Yeah, not like scream stab, more like, you know, just like a little stab with a pencil, but definitely a stab for sure.
We miss you too, Matt. We miss you too, buddy. Are you a scary movie person, Randy? I don't mind scary movies, but I like comedy. Okay, okay. 25 on the button from partner with his freshly doubled stack. Action's on coach with the 8 6 offsuit. I think he's going to make the call. What do you think? Oh, definitely. I, I, I don't think he's seen a suited uh, a gapper that he doesn't like, you know? Suited or unsuited? Suited or unsuited. 7 8 was very evident last hand. 8 6 just as good. Baby Spider raising to 100 with the Queen Jack off. Jackie Moon with the Queen Jack off. Says, I'll call. Uh oh. Jandre, all in, $294. The crazy Azen. <laughs> Partner folds, coach folds, action back around to Baby Spider. I think he's taking the gamble here. He might make a call. Yeah, he's definitely going to call. And I could potentially see Jackie Moon calling off as well. Another 190. We will be going three ways to a flop. Queen Jack off. Queen Jack off. Ace King off. Off to the races we will be going, guys. I would like to say, Jandre's in a great position to double up here. I don't want to juice it, up. but it's triple up. Excuse triple me. Up. You are absolutely right. Who has the diamond? Oh, baby spider with a Ace diamond. Seven deuce. Spider has been running hot. Has hit a couple flushes. Queen. Extra outs. Diamonds are forever. Did go check check on the flop. Let's see if I think it went check check on the river. Nice hand with the Cajun Asian sitting there patiently waiting for something to happen, and it does. I mean, I'm called, said I've been patiently waiting to blow. $931 going to John Dre. We do have guys. I do want to let you guys see this. You can breathe. A twenty-five K tournament from April twenty-fourth through the twenty-eighth. Ten K guaranteed to first place. Several opening flights starting on April 24th. Make your way over. Day two will be on April 28th, guys. Come on over. I want to say it is a $100 buy-in. Best value in town. Make your way over. 25K guarantee. Come on over, baby. We do have a $25 button straddle out there. By coach, action will be on JMK holding back to Spider. Making the fold. Action folding around to Jackie Moon holding the 10 8 of clubs. 25 to go. My Doesn't favorite like hand. To make the call. Partner with the King Jack off says, uh uh, wants to play for a little bit more and does pump in some chips. Price of poker just went up. Coach holding the Queen Six of Spades is definitely not relinquishing his 25 just like that. Elects to make the call. Oh, baby, SAT word of the stream. Relinquish. I like it. AT, ATC poker at this moment, at this time, time on the stream running low. Any two will do. Off to a flop we go. King 2-4, two, two hearts. 
partner out partner. flopping the world. And no one else having anything. Just going to bet 300. Should be enough to take it down. I don't know. Coach is getting a little twinkle in his eye. Cutting out some chips. Let's see if he gets a little frisky here. No, he decides to fold. make the fold. Yeah. Partner coming in and bulldozing his way around this room, around this table. New with the King Queen offsuit. Partner making it one fifty with the Queen of the Mystery card. Coach coming in. Partner with the one fifty now. I like it. All gas, no brakes. Exactly. I have all gas too, but that usually leads to me going to the restroom. Someone went all in. Elude shove for twenty one hundred. I I think that looks right. Yeah, elude shoves for twenty one hundred. Back on partner. Has his thinking cap on. Elude for the twenty one hundred reshove. I like it. Elude being extra, extra, extra saucy with the back raise with the king queen off. You know what to say to fight aggression with aggression. It's definitely got to be some kind of history between those two players. Definitely, I agree. Coach now, really thinking about something here. Let he it happen. He's going to let it, yeah, he does fold. Nice pot going to elude, seeing something that we surely didn't see. I'd really like to ask him what he Round of straddles, round of button straddles, $25 button straddles, still going out there. So essentially we're playing two five twenty five guys. We'll make the game a lot bigger because of the dead money. 
and we are lagging and having a bit of technical difficulties. So once again, I do want to apologize to those that are tuning in. Please be patient. We will be bringing you good action. Lude making the call out of the small blind with the 10 8 of diamonds. So Brino completing as well. King 10 suited. Couple folds out to partner holding the four deuce of diamonds. Making the call. Coach with the eight three of spades making the call as well. Baby Spider getting in there with the Queen Jack off. Off to a flop we go, multi-way. King Jack Jack board. So Greeno holding the only king. Baby Spider on the button. Smashes the flop with three jacks. Action checks around to coach. Who's getting creative with the 8 3 of spades on the King Jack Jack board? When you're drawing nearing dead, you can, can't do much but bet. So I, I like this play. Does make a bet of 50. Should let them know who has what. Maybe Spider making the call. So Brino making the call. A spade would be interesting. If <laughs> we. Do got a five of clubs on the turn. So Brino checks quickly. Action to coach. It looks like he cut out about 140, 150 in chips. Does bet 150. Action's on Baby Spider. So Brino lays down the king. Should be going heads up to a river. Ace of spades on the river. Action will be on coach. Chris is never folding to any size in here, so coach is essentially just lighting these chips on fire if he throws them in the middle. Coach bets out another 150. I want to say baby spider just flats. Yeah, he does, and he takes on the pot of $875. I mean, you can't raise there. You're only going to get called by hands that beat you, but you can call there all day without any hesitation, especially having a queen in his hand, blocking queen 10. No flush possibilities. It's, it's an easy call for baby spider. Elude with the $25 button straddle. Action's gonna be on Sobrino in the small blind. I do want to see some three bet, four bets. Um, relatively light, in my opinion. That's what I want to see. How about yourself, Leo? Yeah, definitely. I, I want to see the stream really pick up. I really want to see the stream pick up. I think it's. It's just brewing for a big blow up this last 45 minutes or so. So I uh, I think we're in a position to see a lot of big pots, especially them knowing the stream's coming to an end. And uh, people love it. People really do love it. Heavy with the king jack off, making the call of 25. Couple folds. Action to coach wakes up with the ladies, pocket queens. Nothing else 
to do but to rip the remaining 152 into the pot, which he does. Elude going to go ahead and protect his button straddle with the 6-7 of diamonds. Makes the call. And Heavy electing to make the call as well. So we will be going three ways to a flop. What an opportunity here for Coach to really triple up. He's at the top of his range playing so many hands. This is players aren't going to expect him to have two queens in this spot. Ten deuce, three board. Two clubs. Check, check. Nine. Both players picking up gutters. Check, check. Pocket Queen's going to go ahead and take it down. Coach is definitely a fun player to watch. He's an um, active, friendly guy on the table. It's always good to mix it up with him. If these players were smart, they'd be using what what they're putting out on the stream to their advantage when they go play other places or when they go play here later on when the stream's over. People are watching. People are taking notice of their tendencies, of the hands they're playing and stuff. So if they're smart and intuitive players, we would really think they'd be taking advantage of what they're putting out there for the world to see. Coach is all in again for the $385 with an over pair. <laughs> JMK with middle pair and a gutty. Might be making this call being stuck. Coach ripping it. Pocket nines. $385 to go if you want to see a churn and river. I like it. No point in allowing another card to come that might shrink your nines and not having any more money behind you. So it should be good enough to get through. Yeah, Jam Kim makes the call. I like the call. He did He's, make the call. He, yeah, he, he does stuck. have a pair and a flush draw. No, no flush draw. A pair, yeah, and, a pair and, a and a gutty. Yeah, with a backdoor flush draw. Okay. No guts, no glory. And that was a quick pot to $1,095. Queen of Clubs on the churn. Jack of Diamonds. And just like that, coaches back up to 1095 without even sweating. I do believe they ran two boards. Oh, so he at okay. least secured half of it. There's, There's the gutty. Comes in. 
So instead of coach winning a thousand ninety five, be taking about half of thousand of five hundred and change. Once again, guys, I do want to go ahead and invite you guys out. This is our happy hour, $6 an hour every day through the month of April from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Halftime, full action. Make your way down to Texas Card House RGB, guys. That's more hands that I see. You know, like, oh, Let's do it again. Action is good. Has slowed down, even though we do have a $25 button straddle. But I do expect it to pick up here in the last uh, 15 to 20 minutes. What's your thoughts, uh, Leo? Like I said, I, I, I think... All the ingredients are, are here for it to be craziness, for it to be mayhem. It's just waiting for a little jolt, a little jump start. One person to lose, the right person to lose the pot, the right person to go on tilt, and all hell can break loose. So we're still waiting. I'm still praying to the poker gods. There's still hope on my end. There you go. Once again, shout out to those watching and tuning in. The real MVPs, guys. Partner, Jack 8 off, releasing. Coach with the 6 3 off. Making the call. Baby Spider electing to raise with the Jack Nine off in the low Jack makes it twenty five to go. Couple folds around the table. Action to Jandre holding the six seven of clubs, making the call, defending his big blind. I believe we went three ways to a flop. Coach not releasing his six three, and actually flopping a six. Andre flopped a better six. Action went check, check. Baby Spider's going to tell a story, continue to tell his story. Andre with a call. Three, three ways going to the turn. Queen of Spades, no help to no one. Checks around, five of diamonds. Check, check. Jandre gonna be patting his stack by $212. Queens and six is seven, kicker. Heavy with the $25 button straddle. Action will be on the Cajun Asian and the small blind. That's a go. Partner. Letting his go. Coach making the call. We 
are lagging, guys. My, my apologies. Coach the King Queen off, making the call. Baby Spider raising it to 110. We do know he does have the nine of clubs. Not too sure about what else he has. Jackie Moon sniffing, seeing something ain't right, makes the call with the seven eight of spades. Wants to see a flop. Enticing coach to come in. So we're going three handed to a flop, and off to a flop we go. Ten nine seven. Interesting flop here, knowing that Chris does have one nine. Everybody did to touch this board. Yes, sir. I'd like to see how this plays out here. Checked over to Jackie Moon. With a Checks pair. Around. Yeah, with a pair and, and a, in, an open and straight draw. Then no, lead. No, no check. Coach checks. Baby Spider checked. Jackie Moon <clears throat> leading out 180. A tad bit over half pot. About three quarters. I don't hate this call from Coach with two overs and a gutty and a Nor back. Do I, but no. I am interested in to see what, what Baby Spider has. I mean, all his combos are touching that board if he doesn't have pocket nines, right? Yeah, yeah. 9 8, 10 9, Jack 9. All that is possible, definitely. for raise two for call he does make a fold it's interesting i would like to really see what that rfd readers had his real cards at and coach baby getting there with a the gut shot jackie wow, Moon on the wrong end of this call. side yeah, terrible call. not only that but he does have backdoor hearts to go with that so all but locked his hand up well, I went all in and call, I think. Yeah, all in call, and we're going to a river. Really interesting to see what uh, Baby Spider had with the nine on the river there. <clears throat> Maybe queen nine It's the best I can think of. The worst possible hand. Ace nine is the worst hand you can have there. Ace nine would be, yeah. You'd rather have Coach. queen nine. Crawling back. Alligator blood, baby, from yes, 100 sir. and change, gets to 500 and change, and now is taking down a pot of nearly, what was the pot? 1,000 and change? It was 780.58 before he put the rest of the money, so right around 1K, I would say. Nice, nice pot going that way. Guys, I do want to let everybody in the chat at home know that we do have tournaments on Fridays and Saturday nights, or Saturday nights and Tuesday nights, guys. Super Turbo Tuesdays every Saturday at 7 p.m., 1,000 guaranteed, $100 buy-in, 15K starting stack, unlimited rebuys for the first three hours, 10-minute levels. And every Wednesday, we do have a 1K free row every Wednesday, guys. $1,000 guarantee, 1K starting stack for free. Absolutely nothing at your cost. We do have Saturday Night Fever. Every Saturday at 6 p.m., we do host a 3K guarantee, $120 buy-in, 25K starting stack, 
unlimited rebuys for the first three hours, guys. So if you're not into cash and want to get you dabble in some tournament, we have that as well. Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Saturdays. Back to the action we go here. Baby Spider making a raise with the King Deuce offsuit to 30. A couple of folds around, picking up heavy with the 10 4 of clubs. We are going multi weight to a flop. 5 6 9, two hearts. Does check around. Ace of hearts on the turn. JMK turning Jin under the gun leads out for 65. Baby Spider making the call with the King Deuce offsuit. Action back around to Coach who was holding the walking sticks. Gonna find their way to the muck. Heads up going to a river. Baby Spider with bad intentions. Ace on the river. Action on JMK. Gotta continue to let Baby Spider take the lead here. There's no point. Uh, yeah, there's no point in letting uh, in betting here. You get nothing accomplished. Leads out 125. Yeah, he should have checked and induced some bluffs. I mean, the ace I is think an he ugly did. card. Wait a minute. What happened there? Someone has an ace, dude. Yeah, maybe Spider looks to have an ace there. We, There was a misread. Maybe Spider holding the ace king offsuit. I think. I, I can't I even that, tell you who won right now, guys. Well, I'm sorry. Because there's a... Nine of hearts in his hand and nine of hearts in his in the board. So, mm. like I said, guys, we are having technical difficulties tonight. Um, the system is lagging a little bit, so I do apologize. I want to go ahead and apologize to everyone who's tuning in. Please be patient. We are working out the kinks. This is a stream that we want to continue to grow and get better and you know you can't get to be the best without a few hiccups in between so again we are working towards an end goal and that is to be the best stream around and these are just small hiccups that we, we're starting with but with your support and your help we're, i mean we want to continue to grow for sure once again guys i am randy chavez you can follow me on all social media platforms under randy runs it up do have our co-host Leo Zamaripa. Follow him along along the way through all social media platforms under Leo Zamaripa, I believe. Am I right? Yes, sir. That's right. Leo Zamaripa. Last name is Z-A-M-A-R-R-I-P-A. -R -R Had a few of you all say that you didn't know how to spell my last name. So Z-A-M-A-R-R-I-P-A. -R -R it's a mouthful. I was Italian once. Zamaripa. Ten dollar straddle out there for you, Luke. The round of straddles seems to be over. It was good while it lasted. <laughs> Once again, Leo, I want to go ahead and um, be one of the first ones to thank you for coming out as well, bro, and being out here on the live commentary and navigating these streets of Texas Hold'em with me. Um, this is our first time getting to do a dual commentary. I know you held it down through the 25K Madness uh, tournaments at the Wednesday I mean, streams. You were busy kind of winning that thing. So, of course, I had to hold it down for my partner. You know, it's big being out here. It's, uh, it's great having a, a partner that enjoys the game as much as I do. And uh, it's, it's refreshing to hear a different point of view as well. And uh, I, I see great things in our future. I'm just glad to be a part of it, and glad I get to help you, me, and Texas Card House grow as a, as we continue to navigate the streets. Like you said, it's going to be fun, and I'm glad we have each other's back. And I'm glad 
that we're finally getting to do this. We talked about it before. Now it's coming to fruition. So golf claps. <laughs> dun, 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 Coach. Dun. Flopping a gut shot and leading out 60 right into the pre-flop aggressor. Baby Spider is most definitely going to peel here, in my opinion. Agreed. And Agreed. Six of spades on the turn. Once again, I, Coach leading out for 100. I like a call again. I think Baby Spider will, will continue to call here. Yep. And he does. Hand doesn't really make sense to be leading twice with the board pairing as well. Your I hand believe, is really condensed. I believe Coach was going to lead River as well. He still might lead River. Ace of Spades on the River, completing the backdoor flush. But slamming Baby Spider's range. And Coach does bet. It's on 150. Um... Baby spider no way does baby call. spider fold. Yeah, no way does baby spider fold there for. If he thought ace high was good, definitely a pair of aces is way good. Like I said, uh, baby spider's been playing extremely well. He's uh, navigated his way, not really, always really knowing where he's at in each hand, and it's good. It's it's great to see someone you know really take control of a stream, applying max pressure, and really like I said, not never having hard decisions you know and that's what you want to do in poker you want to make sure you make the best decision you want to make easy decisions the more tough decisions you put yourself in the harder it is for you to be to win the hand in the tournament for you to, to, to do little things like that so uh as you can see when uh, baby spider's been in most hands he's had easy decisions easy whether it's a fold or not it's an easy decision and in poker you want to make yourself make the easiest decision and the best decision at that agree you don't want somebody else to put that price out there for you yeah exactly and, and what a lot of people don't understand is sometimes you're going to fold the best hand sometimes you are going to get bluffed but when you have the best hand your goal is to extract as much money as you can when you have the best hand and when you have the worst of it to lose as little as possible so those are the, 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 the keys to poker. You know what I mean? It sounds super easy, guys, but it really isn't. But that's what you want to do. When you have the best of it, extract as much money from your opponent. When you have the worst of it, you want to lose as, as least money as possible. Or do like I do. Cross your fingers, put all the chips in, and pray to the poker gods. That's very true, Randy. That is very true. Some people have the horseshoe located so far up their nostrils that... You know, they can just run like Randy. Back to the action we go. Baby Spider with a three bet to 60 with a 10-9 of clubs. Action back around to Jandre holding the 7-8 of diamonds. He will complete and we will go to a flop. Off to a flop we go. King eight six, two hearts. Baby spider flopping a gutter. Leads out for 80. Dondre, 80 to call. Second pair. Backdoor outs. He does not want his second pair to smash the board. I know that, but he doesn't know that. Be very bad make, for him. It would be very bad. Yeah, he does make the call. We will be seeing the turn. Baby Spider continuing in his run good on today's stream, turning a pair. So he does have a pair in a gut shot. Dondre does have a pair in a gut shot as well. Baby Spider checking. Check, check on the churn. Off to a river we go. Jack of clubs. No help. I believe we might see 
check check. I don't see it getting. It does go check check. Maybe Spider pat in the stack. He definitely, I think, is our biggest winner of tonight's stream so far. So shots out to him. Chat, let us know who you want us to bring back. We will be here every Wednesday and every Friday. Once again, thank you to all those that are tuning in on this Friday evening to watch the 2-5 Hold'em game running here at Texas Card House every Friday at 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. That's just the live stream. We will be continuing the game post stream, guys. So make your way over. There is a couple floors running on the main floor. All promos are in play. We do have three more hands, Randy. Let's get the chat going. Let's get the big pot energy hype. Let's Let's make it happen. BPE, baby. Big pot energy. Let's go. Boom, boom, boom. You got a button straddle. I believe that's 10. Yeah, it is a $10 button straddle. It'd be nice to have some stuff to throw in some um, music and other little things here, you know? Yeah, yeah some, some little uh, side effects. Some little effects we can throw in. I'm sure we can figure out a way to get that going some good stuff i don't know what's happening but i feel like there's a lot of people seeing this flop yep rgv special King, Queen, Deuce, Rainbow. Um, see, top pair for the Cajun Asian. I, I I think this is the first hand everybody went to a flop. Uh, Legit, everybody went to a flop. <laughs> oh, wow. Jandre with a raise. Heavy. Calling with the 3-4. It's, it's got to be wrong, right? Um, I... I mean, he knew the five was coming, right? I mean, <laughs> no, obviously, I... <laughs> obviously, the dealer kicked him under the table and said, "Hey, buddy, I'm gonna pick up some equity on this turn." No, um, there's been several misreads today, guys, and that's why we've been apologizing for our technical difficulties. Um, we are working, do we are doing our due diligence to bring you guys the best stream possible here in the Texas Card House RGB. Um, we are fairly new to this, and we are doing our best, guys. So we do ask you guys to please stay patient and work with us. No, he did have the three, four of hearts. And proudly shows it, too. Nutlow, second Nutlow coming in. Two more hands. That wasn't More the big pot energy we were really hoping for.
was last time you Man, who knew who who knew Parker was going to be on lockdown after one crazy hand? Yeah, he locked it down. Um, that's fine too. I mean, yeah, hey, hey, you do we, you, man. You come to play to win, baby. Ace Ace Queen. We're gonna get some action post flop here. Off to a turn. We're gonna go to a three. Heavy holding the Ace Ten. Baby Spider smashing the turn. It's bad news for heavy. BPE, you wanted big pot energy. You got it, buddy. Let's get it. And I don't see heavy folding ever. So Brino making the call. I'm assuming uh, he's holding the last the last ace, right? A6? I mean, that's all I can think of as well. That's all I can see. Heavy ripping his remaining 347 all into the pot. Action back around to Baby Spider. 237 to call. Goes ahead and just puts Sobrino all in. Max pressure, max pain. Wow, might wow. be an easy, it, it might be, the, the way as played might allow Sobrino to save some money here. Yeah, I don't see heavy folding at all. Oh, folding, uh, heavy's already all in. Oh, heavy's already all in? Okay, I, I'm glad. And Sobrino then. does uh, release. release. If he was down, I think he called, but I think he's up right now. He couldn't be too certain. Run like crazy. Get by the vida. Just turn a full house. No yeah. big deal. Continue you know. to run good. Yeah, it's the hair, bro. If I had hair like that, I'd run good too. Jack of hearts on the river. That's all she wrote. Guys, I do want to go ahead and thank it. once again everybody who came who tuned in tonight um, with me alongside Leo Zamaripa to watch this 2-5 um, Texas Hold'em game that went down here at Texas Card House, right? Um, it was fun and enjoyable here in the All-American City. Without you, we couldn't do it without you guys. So we really want to thank you and appreciate those that are tuning in and jumping in our chats and Big thank yous to all of you guys. Oh, they decided to run the river twice? Looks like a seven. GG to heavy. I think we're gonna go into our last hand. I'll leave it to Leo to take us out. Yeah, this will be our last hand, definitely. Thank you guys. Once again, I'm Randy Chavez. Follow me on all social media platforms under Randy Runs It Up. Last hand. Let's see what this hand brings. Hopefully, we get one more big pot. Heavy is out for the night. We'll be playing this pot eight-handed. So let's see what happens. We got a button shuttle to ten. It's going to be actually the small bite on Sobrino. So we're going to go with two nines, raising it up to 35. Partner playing tighter than Mike Belt after a buffet after he wins one pot. Looks like rent is due. Coach with the queen and a mystery card makes the call.
Baby Spider makes a call with the 9 8 of Diamonds. Elude makes a call with the 10 8 Offsuit. RGV Special, four handed. Last pot of the night. Ace Jack 3, two clubs. Coach Bet 75. So bring no thinking about it. He says, I'm out there. We're heads up to a turn. Ten of clubs. Bet in a call. Heads up. Let's see the river. Four of spades. Coach showing ace queen. Taking down the last part of the night. Over 810 in the middle. That'll pad his stack. Get him about even or a little bit over for the night. This is the last hand of the night, guys. Once again, I'd like to thank, thank you all for uh, spending your Friday evening with us. Such a great dynamic having Randy on the other side. We're also known better as Beauty and the Beast. You choose who's Beauty, who's the Beast. Can't wait to be back on Wednesday for the 1-3 live stream. Thank you so much again. Enjoy your weekend. LFG 